YouTube, hello, welcome to the stream. We are back in Pokemon Scarlet. The first of two DLCs is out today. I believe this one is the Teal Mask. Uh, I'm excited to return back to the PowerPoint presentation that is Pokemon Scarlet. I haven't played in a while. I kind of fell off this game hard, plus ratio L. I'm bald, better with Achievement Hunter, Minecraft, whatever. Um, so it'll be interesting to get back into it. I don't remember what I was doing last time. I don't remember what Pokemon I have. So, uh, yeah, we'll see how this goes. I have two days marked off on my schedule for it, so kind of take my time and maybe take it all in and hopefully we enjoy it hopefully you're enjoying it let me know what you think uh in the comments below uh besides that like comment subscribe on the video buy something from framerate youtube hope you enjoy the vod i love you and i'll see you in a second all right youtube by the time this gets uploaded the nintendo direct uh happened already was it good let me know in the comments as well. Did they announce Mario Party 3? Am I super hyped right now? I don't know. We'd have no idea what happened. Oh, yeah. I have the Larry. Uh, I updated my picture to Larry. I saw a funny post online that uh, <laughs> it was Larry is a flying type gym leader. This is in reference to the fact that he wants to jump off a building. I'm like, God damn. All right. Where's the lie, though? This dude works two jobs. A flying gym leader? Or no, he was a flying... He was a flying Elite Four member and a normal gym leader. I think that's what it was. Um, but he's working two jobs, man. Oh, and then he, he has, like, another job, right? Like, a, a, a normal job? Hazard, thank you for the 33 months. Honestly, the most exciting thing about this DLC is I'm going to be able to change my goddamn clothes. All right, here we go. Off the rip. It's Jacques! Hello, this is Jacques. Hello, Mr. Jacques. Sorry to bother you while you're probably out searching for some nice treasure. You see, we have a school trip year-round, or every year around this time. Special collaboration between our academy and another school. Would you believe it, Ray? Your name was one of the ones chosen to attend. You'll get to go study and experience the great outdoors off to the east in the land of Kitakami. It's a long trip uh, to get to this year's destination. We can't spend this year's time. You're really a lucky one getting selected. School's entrance hall. Okay. Of course, you don't have to take part. No, I will. Why am I staring at a wall? What the fuck? What was I doing? Oh, there's a Pokemon Center. Okay. Oh. Ugh. Hey, all right. So the last game I played, last Pokemon game I put a lot of time into before this Uh like, that I finished was Luminous and Platinum, which, uh, you know, screenshot, is a better game. How the fuck do I play this game? There we go. Okay. Okay. So, it's, I'm, what Pokemon do I have? Oh, Talonflame. That makes sense, because I was hatching eggs. Uh, oh, this is the box of, like, event Pokemon. Okay. Oh, these are, like, my leveled up Pokemon. Oh, here's my poke. Here's my Breloom for catching Pokemon, right? Mock Punch, False Swipe, Spore, Seed Bomb. Probably want him. These are Gen Pokemon I used for uh, raids. But these I actually trained myself. Uh, okay, and this is like the living decks I was working on, and then I just didn't want to play Scarlet and Violet anymore. Um, okay. Yeah, it does look like the boxes are faster, to be fair. Which is nice. Um, oh, and then these are like other... Okay, yeah. So this shit isn't organized, I think. Or maybe some of it is. I don't remember. Hmm. All right. Oh, yeah. I was doing like trades and stuff and doing some uh, raids and whatnot. Okay. It's kind of coming back to me. Uh, who can we use here? God damn. I guess I'll put in... Uh... I mean, I need Breloom at the very least to help catch Pokemon. Talonflame, we'll have you just kind of bing chill over here, I guess. Yeah, th these boxes are infinitely faster. Whoops. Swap, please. We need to bring fucking Dole back. I might just use the same Pokemon I used last time, honestly. If I remember what it was. Fucking why not, dude? Not like I trained any other Pokemon. 
And we'll put you at the bottom. Uh, I could use Sandy Shocks. This is shiny, right? It's shiny, but you can, like, barely tell, I think. Is it supposed to be gold? Oh, no, no, that's not the shiny one. Where's the shiny one? I did get a shiny one, right? Maybe I'm making that up. I'm could have sworn I got a shiny one. Um, Chiyu, Iron Hands. I guess I'll grab my, uh, grab the Skeledurge. And Screamtail. Brute Bonnet, Great Tusk. Okay. Yeah, we'll just fuck with this ragtag bunch of, of Pokemon for now. And then I have some, like, OP shit if I need it over here. <laughs> yeah, I used, uh, oh, Tinkaton. Tinkaton is who I used. She was fun to use. Big Hammer. But I don't know where she is. Oh, this is the one I used. Here we go. Hammer go boom. These don't, like, have items or anything, but I think we'll be fine. I'm leading with Tropius. Alright, how the fuck do I fly in this game? How do I open the map? How do I do anything? Nope, that's the Pokedex. I forgot how to open the map. That's not it either. Nope. Wasn't there a button to open the map? Wait. Was that it? Nope. Oh, no. Oh, God, no. I don't need this. Jesus. Yeah, sure, whatever. I forgot how to open the map. There it is. Jesus Christ. It's the last button I hit. Uh, I have to go to school, right? Yeah, okay. Please. Guys, it's all coming back to me. Alright, so one improvement. The boxes load faster. Ah, uh, this game looks just as good as I remember it. Oh, I should check, like, what Pokeballs and stuff I have. Uh, yeah, what's the Pokeball situation? Do I have, like, a million Quick Balls? I have 76, okay. We should be fine. Good thing I have my Master Ball, just in case. Uh, okay. Yeah, Sword items. Whoops. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. It's like I've never played a video game before in my life. Stop hitting that fucking button. Uh, what was it? Newest first? Oh, there we go. It was Swords Dance I found. Okay. I'm ready. Shout out to that Psyduck in the back. Yo, you're kind of cute. Are you? Oh, you must be. You're one of the students chosen for the school trip, aren't you? And your name was Ray, ma'am. Yeah, dude. Aren't you a polite one? You're positively dazzling. I do have a Terra Orb. I guess Paldea is rich enough in resources for that sort of thing to be common sight at school. Unless that's not the case. Are you perhaps an especially exceptional student? <laughs> no, no. I can figure out how to open the map. Yeah. Oh, but here I go on and on. I haven't even introduced myself. Call me. Miss Briar! Do you really have three eyes in your name? I'm so sorry I'm late. Hello to you too, Ray. What a lucky scamp you are. Whoa, dude, relax. Getting to take part in school trip so soon after transferring here. I sure am happy for you. I wish I could go too. Ahem. Oh, I'm sorry, Miss Briar. I got a bit carried away. Well, as Mr. Jock so kindly stated for me, my name is Briar. I'm a teacher over at Blueberry Academy. That's a school in the Unova region, Gen 5. Ew, am I right, guys? You know Miss Briar helped set the curriculum there. I can't wait for all these Pokemon to evolve at level 106, then. This year is Blueberry Academy's turn to run our joint school trip and supervise the students. Whoa, Jock, dude, for free? Uh, supervise students, that's where I came to collect you. We'll be heading to Kitakama, a land known for its picturesque fields and rice paddies. This place has a rustic feel, but there's also something rather mysterious about it. You see the same energy present in Paldea's ter uh, terrestrial phenomenon has been detected there. Hoping to do some digging into the matter myself in between my supervising duties. 
Though I also appreciate the chance to take a good look around the great crater of Paldea. Ah, uh, yes. Well, there's not much I can do about that without permission from the Pokemon League and Director Clavel. Oh, I know. I've already put in all the proper applications. I trust I'll get a favorable response soon. Ah, well. Hmm. Oh, sorry. Ray forgot all about you for a moment there. Jesus. School trip. Think of it as grand treasure hunt. Uh, grander scale. Search beyond Paldea's borders. Yep. Provide you with a special update to your Pokedex app. But get up my phone. Sure. Thanks. And there we go. All done. Now I can go wild registering all the Pokemon you find around Kitakama too. Don't worry about a permission slip from the trip. I already cleared things with your mom. Thanks, man. Mr. Jock is quite charming, isn't he? Delightfully direct when he wants to be. And then Ray. It's quite a trip to the land of Kitakama. Hope you don't mind flying or long bus rides. Let me know as soon as you're ready to set out. Yeah, dude. Let's go. I'm ready. We'll set out together as a group once the other students arrive. I hear you were all chosen for the trip by lottery, so this may be the first time you meet. I know my role is to chaperone you kids around, but I fully intend to have some fun on my own. Ooh, just so you're aware. I like her, like, little corset thing. By the way, do you know of the Scarlet Book? Never heard of it. Really? Well, that's unexpected. I'm quite sure at least one copy was donated to the school. The author of the Scarlet Book, Heath, was in fact an ancestor of mine. I even have his original manuscript. Oh, cool. Maybe. Oh, you just have that on you. Look here. These are the pages that were blacked out and made illegible in the published version of the book. A disc Pokemon? No, I'm not reading that. Yep. Oh, it's like the big turtle. It's a mysterious Pokemon that Heath allegedly encountered when he delved even further into the depths of Area Zero. Not the general public believed him. It's my dream to find uh, Terop... Terapagos? Oh, like Galapagos, I guess. And prove that Heath's records were all true. Though I haven't yet been able to secure permission to enter Area Zero, unfortunately. But that's all fine. No, but that's fine. I'll be fine. All I need to do now is focus on the work that's in front of me. Miss Briar, we're ready to go. Oh, it's these characters. Looks like the gang's all here. How can we forget these guys? WH Omega lol? Thank you for the resubs, gamers. Thank you. Oh, the little Dragonite next to the plane is cute. Actually, it's kind of terrifying. If you're flying and a big-ass dragon's flying next to you, are you kidding me? Granted, Dragonite's a fucking doofy Pokemon, but still. Let's go! The Teal Mask. Hope we're running to Jim Carrey. We're finally here. Oh, I like the Pelipper on the bench. My butt is killing me after all those hours sitting. First the plane, then the bus. Will you survive the long trip? We haven't lost anyone along the way. All here. And welcome to the land of Kitakama. I guess they don't reuse the, your friends from the main game, which is a shame. That was a good group. Shout out to Namona. This is the stage for all the new experiences. Mm -hmm. Sure. Hey, Yanma. Oh, there's a Jetonian Whooper. It's actually my first time here, too. Why the rice fields really are just dazzling. Mm, are they, though? Missouri Town. Base of operations, sure. Miss Briar, I don't feel so good. The kid starts fucking fading away. Thanos snapped. People are dying everywhere in Paldea. Uh-oh. All that travel must have given you a dose of motion sickness, huh? Why don't we pause here for a moment and take in the sight of these fields? Now, Ray, I have a little request for you. Could you run ahead to the community center in Missouri uh, and let the caretaker know we're here? Uh, it would also be great if you could explain that one of our students is feeling unwell. Yeah, he's got the shits. I got it. 
I know to be able to count on you. On your way, look after your poor travel buddy here. All right. I can't ride Karaidon. This game sucks. All right, what do we got here? Spinarak? Oh, Poochina for Tina. Oh, level 55. These are actually kind of high level. Oh, the fucking battle theme goes hard. Nice. Oh, I should probably put these in like a different box because... I'm just going to be catching these willy-nilly. It bears its large fangs and barks vigorously. Okay, I can't see the rest. Uh, to try and intimidate opponents, but this is actually a manifestation of its cowardly nature. Yo, drag him. Drag him. Alright, uh, so boxes. Yeah, we'll just start using, like, this box over here. It feels so weird to not have, uh, my bike. Potion. I keep clicking in the goddamn left stick to sprint. But obviously you, you don't sprint. Ooh, bulldoze. Hey, Yanma. Yanma! No! Yanma! Oh, wait, can't you, like, throw your... Oh, yeah, there you go. Get in the flask. No! Uh, well, I don't want to kill this thing. I think Dragon Pulse will still kill this thing, but... I'm like 20 levels higher than it. Oh, actually... Oh, it's a waddle! Uh... Can you just get in a ball? Get in the goddamn... Why, why do I have 999 Pokeballs? Or 899? What was I doing? What was I cooking? Yo, this guy's kind of a fucking jabroni, I'll say it. Alright. I probably bought them at the end of my playthrough, because I had a shit ton of money, and... I assume, like, when I did the... Like, when you do raids, they're guaranteed catches, right? So I just put everything in a Pokeball? Maybe that was my mindset? Bro, I, I don't know. I don't know what pass Ray was cooking, but I was I was on something. So Waddle, don't worry, you're next. This is the hardest Yanma to catch for some reason. There we go. Cool. Just run away and re-engage with a quick ball. Just, uh, shut up. Idiot. As Yama surveys its territory, it periodically stops to hover in place by flapping its wings at high speeds. See you. Oh, hey man. Rabombi? Is Rabombi new in this? I don't even remember. Rabombi! Ooh, Rabombi's little. I mean, cutie fly, sorry. It involves in a Rabombi. Yeah, dude. Why couldn't they all be like that? Sick. Bug fairy. Hell yeah. All right, where's that Sawaddle? I think he's up there. There's a spinner up there too, but I can't do shit. 
Oh, there's some waddle. Hey, buddy. Dude, it waddled off. Oh, shit. Jokes! Alright. So, for some reason, the only problem Pokemon was Yanma. <laughs> Sick. Thanks, Sawaddle. Sawaddle chews on leaves to make its clothing. It's trying to mimic the leafy garment Lavani. Or Leavani. First dressed in. Sick. Yeah, I was about to say, doesn't Yanma kind of have a low catch rate? Alright, I can't stand moving this slow. And I don't remember if there's a sprint. So I guess I'll just make my way to the objective. So I can use my dragon. Do -do -do -do. Good. Good. I see they upped performance. Oh, shit. Hi, Whooper. What a cute little guy. Uh huh. Whoops. Actually, Tropius, why not? Go crazy. Can you even go up these hills? No, not really. Okay. Dole! Yeah, dude. Yo, SDJ, thank you. Random citizen, have a good day, dude. Oh, these are the schmucks with the bangs. That dude just popped in with the bullpicks over there. Sis, look. There, there's one now. This game is just as beautiful as I remember. <laughs> It sure is. So you're one of those students who came from the Paldea region, huh? Whoa, way cool. Hush, Kyrian. I'm Carmine. Oh, if you were in Gears of War, you'd be dead now. Sorry, but I can't just let an outsider like you wander into... Oh, what the fuck? Okay. If you insist on coming in, you'll have to battle me first. Come on, sis. You just want to battle making this big fuss over nothing. I told you to hush, Kiki. Kiki, do you love me? All right, I guess we're fighting. This is this is gatekeeping. Can you heal my Tropius? I'm gonna have some real good fun with you. I like your eye color. Get ready to eat dirt. But this was a kid game, a kid's game. She'd say eat shit. Is this the one that doesn't miss? All right, Raw Hurricane, no fear. Yeah, dude. Let's go. Oh, ew. Oh, that's right. There's no fucking set mode in this. I forgot. Yeah, I just mash B. Little Vulpix. Another raw hurricane. No fear. One fear. One fear. Disable. No! I guess we could Dragon Pulse. This game is incredibly slow. Good lord. <laughs> Good fucking lord. How's that for a first taste of Kitakama? I mean... It hurt. Tropics, thank you for the 32. Oh, this is a new one. Poltergeist. What is this? A grass ghost, right? 
It's got a stick! Uh... We're gonna take a ton. Why not? Hello! I'm a cutie with a big hammer. Go on, Pulcher guys. Teach him a lesson with Shadow Ball. Okay. Bro, I can't even see the thing because of my <laughs> because of my hammer. That crit mattered. Oh, you know about type matchups. I do. I do know about type matchups. I'm so sorry. Come on, that was just a lucky hit. It kind of was. I mean, it was a crit. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, thanks, new hop. There we go. Why is the brother rooting for me? Who are you? I'm Ray. Hey. Wowzers, you went and beat my... Oh, my God, the dude in the back. <laughs> this game sucks. <laughs> I can't believe it. There's no way you should have been able to beat me. Oh, the Vulpix as well, yeah. Fine, I guess you pass barely. Seems I got no choice. I'll let you into town, but only if you become one of my grunts and do every little thing I... Oi! What are you doing? Here comes trouble. Come on, Kiki, we're out of here. But I... What up, sis? Hey, Sandals. Why, hello there, stranger. You must be one of the students from the Paldean Academy, right? I help run the community center here in Mosui. Uh, and a few, f a fair few other things besides. Be looking after your group during your visit. Uh-huh. Hope those two kids won't give you any grief. Nah. Actually, yes, punish them. They were being mean to me. I hardly know what to do with the two of them, especially that Carmine. Always been a handful. That one, I apologize. She gave you a hard time. What's that? A member of your group fell ill down by the bus stop? Yeah, man. Did you hear about that plane going from Atlanta to, like, Madrid or some shit? That guy shitting on the whole airplane? Yeah, that was that kid. So, he needs help. I'd better get over there and give them a hand so they can make it on, on to, into town. I'll take care of everything. You go ahead and get yourself settled in the community center. Yeah, I just need to heal. See ya. Landed to Barcelona. That's what it was. Dude had an anal evacuation. Why can I, like, not walk up? Or not run up? Oh, shit. Oh, she's cute. Is this a new... Pokemon trainer? Or, uh, Nurse Joy? She's sick. New TMs! You can now filter for learnable moves. I want a TM made. While viewing TMs on TM machine, you press X to select and look one currently in your party, huh? Okay. Oh, that's really cool. For some reason, I thought that was, like, in the game already. Hmm. Oh, hey. Nine tails. Nah, I'm good. Quality of life, I know, right? Um... Oh, okay. I was like, why can't I move? <laughs> this way, everyone. Ray, I owe you one for fetching the caretaker. Little travel buddy's feeling much better now, too. All right, everyone. This is the community center. This is where you, you know, you summon the Junimos. Take down Joja. Blueberry Academy, uh-huh. Yep. Orange Academy, whatever. Yes, is that kid done shitting? You 
No need to worry about your shoes or anything. You can leave them here. If you're feeling extra, if they're extra dirty, just try to rinse them off. Uh, okay. Yep. Got it. Oh, that's a cute little, uh, like, chingling thing on the left. Nice and clean inside, don't you think? It's all newly built, so it's as good as anything you'd find. Your big fancy cities. So here's a lounge. You can watch TV, chat, or relax however you like. Sure. The cafeteria. Toilets are that way. If you want to get some sleep, please use the rooms. Okay. Private room to yourself. Think about covers everything. If you're in any trouble, hesitate to ask at the desk. Sure. You have anything to say to the staff will be taking good care of us. Uh, thanks for having us. Thank you for having us. What a bunch of well-mannered students. Thanks, man. Yeah, our home away from home. Tired for such a long day. It's a bit early. Why don't we have dinner? Call it a night. All right. Thanks for dinner. Num, 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 num. You're free to spend the rest of the evening as you like in the community center. But remember that tomorrow the program will be kicking off. Don't stay up too late. I mean, is there really anything else to do in here? <laughs> Fucking like right here up to the TV. Conference room. Yeah, can I beat up any other kids? Boys restroom, girls restroom. Oh, the game's woke. The game's woke. I'm shutting it off. Game's woke. Not playing it. Game's woke. 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 That's a nice addition. That's cute. Welcome, dear Paldean student. We provide a special service to visitors here at the Kitakami Community Center. Uh, if you open your bag, want to notice that theme of the upper and lower boards of your screen menu now change? Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. I didn't even notice that. Do they? Oh, yeah. Look at that. They're green. That's cool. That's a nice little touch. Hey, kid. There's a bug Pokemon in there. Oh, shit. I don't want to fucking stay in there. Can I get out of these ugly goddamn school clothes and put on a like, green robe or whatever? It's a stick bug Pokemon. <laughs> I want to go to bed. Ah, I got stick bugged. Morning, everyone. Did you sleep well? Starting today, we'll be joining, joined by our two students from Blueberry Academy. Go on, kids. Time to introduce yourselves. I'm Carmine. It's a pleasure to meet all you outsiders. I mean, visitors from Paldea. I'm Kiki. Carmine and Kieran actually grew up here, so ask them for help if you need anything. And you two had better be of real help, you hear me? Aye, aye. Right. Not that settled, why don't I tell you all a bit about what we have planned for you? School trip of yours would be an exercise in orienteering. Is that what that said? Split into pairs, and each pair will be tasked with finding three signboards located around the land of Kitakami. On each signboard, you'll find snippets of an old folktale passed down here in Kitakami. Read them all. Okay. Didn't we have to do something similar in uh, Isle of Armor? <laughs> uh, prove you completed a task. We asked you to take a snapshot in front of the signboards. Okay. Okay, yeah. Learn history or whatever. Sure. Much more fun than sitting around and listening to me ramble on and on. Wonderful. What an innovative idea for a group activity. Oh, and I've got a gift for each of you as well. New drip? Oh. God damn it. Oh, yeah. This is the selfie stick. Thanks. Press the X button while in selfie mode. Bro, I don't even know how to open the map. You think I know how to open selfie mode? Sure. Here, these things are all the rage in the big cities. Use them when you take photos. I'll even teach you a rad... Oh, shit, a rad pose. The Eureka emote. Okay. Ah, yes. Real rad. <laughs> Remember that one of the goals of this trip is to deepen the ties between our two schools. It seems like having... Someone who knows the area would be a big help. That being said, let's try to maximize the number of inter school pairs. Yep. Time to mingle. I guess we're off to the races. 
Oh. Am I gonna make friends? Oh man. <laughs> Same. You're rare or whatever, right? We literally just battled. Let me guess, you wanna pair up with one of us poor lonely blueberry students. Yes. So sweet of you to go out of your way like that. What would we ever do without you? Oh yeah, sorry, my little brother here has been all googly eyed over you since yesterday. He wouldn't stop talking about you even at home. I seriously couldn't get him to shut up. Love the fans. Sis, what are you telling her that for, dummy? Watch you call dummy if you know what's good for you. Oh, fuck. A narc, dude. She's a narc. Oh, man. Look at him being all shy. See, my brother's no good at talking to people. He'd probably never work up the nerve to ask you himself, but he really like a battle with you. Sure. Turns out you're sort of nice. What the fuck? Chin up, Kiki. Ray says she'll battle you. What? Wowzers. No, I don't mind. Let's do it, man. This kid's gonna have like five Arceus's. My dude's got a Sentret. Let's go. Love that for you. Wow, I can't believe I get to battle you. This is awesome. This shit should have evolved like 40 levels ago. We'll just Magical Leaf, I guess. Pop. Uh, <laughs> Eviolite Sentret. Well, it hasn't evolved yet either. He keeps mashing BU. He has a, uh, what is it, an Everstone? You got this, Yanma. Cut through the wind and show him what you've got. God damn it, Tropius, you stupid idiot. Hurricane again, I want to believe. Spicy crit. There we go! Oof. I guess I have a lot of weaknesses. You, Yeah, you are bug flying. I did it. Where to go, Tropius? Where to go? Wowzers. I don't know why I'm not using my shiny one. Did I put it in Pokemon Home? I have no idea where my shiny Pokemon are in this game. Jay, thank you for the 55. Thank you for all the resubs, by the way, gamers. Good show. Nicely done, kids. Nothing like a friendly battle to get to know someone. Wowzers, you sure are strong, right? You really aren't half bad. Kiki's nearly as strong as I am, you know? Yeah, I mean, he used a Sentret and a Yanma. I don't know about that. Uh, this orienteering thing, we're supposed to group up in pairs, right? You should go ahead and pair up with Kiki then. What? No, sis, don't. Don't what? It's not like we can pair up or... Were you hoping to partner with some other rando outsider instead of Ray? Well, no, but... Oh man. He's just being shy. All right, yeah, I'll watch your little brother. Looks like you've all paired up. Let's go ahead and mark where you'll be going in the Rotom phones of yours. Why is my Rotom phone green? I don't remember. Is it like a skin or something? A case? Okay, that's the Mart. Loyalty Plaza. All right, let's go. Yeah, just stay behind me. All right, see ya. Oh, swine up! Yeah, why can I not, like, run in a straight line, but I can run diagonally? What is up with this game? Weird. Can I see how big the, uh... The map is? 
Uh, Eleanor to switch the maps. That's fine. Oh, this is kind of sizable. Not too big. Bunch of raids and shit. Ooh, a mystery. There's a couple of those, huh? I just need to get my Coridon back. That'd be so nice. All right, well, I guess I'll just uh, go this way. Wait, aren't you guys, like, fucking extinct or something? Anyway, Hisui and Growlithe. Oh, can I, like, get up there? Oh! All right, I guess I could just ride it now. All right, well, there goes that problem. That was weird. Uh, anyway. Anyway, whatever that problem was with walking forward, uh, it, it's fixed now. <laughs> fucking control this thing again? Alright, there we go. Yeah, it's all coming back to me. Oh, I guess I get some of the shit over here. Alright, oh, there is XP candy in this game. Bro, everything about this game has like, once I finished playing it, just like went out of my brain. I was, like, all about it, and then I was done playing it, and then it was just, all, it was all gone. Oh, look at little Pichu. Hey, buddy. Starly. I'm glad you remember what... <laughs> I remember what Pokemon is. I just, uh... Forgot, like, everything about this game, because it's... Really just rough to play. Yeah, A dude. sweet apple. Whoops. Please. Oh, let's go dire hit. This is like a super strong apple. <laughs> it is. Alright. Alright, these guys like Terra and shit. Oh, Terra Bug. That's rough, buddy. Some might kill me, though. Oh, no. I healed up. Confusion! Yeah, you, like, have to break their Terra or some shit, right? And then uh, you could like, catch them normally. Uh, I guess I'll try catching you. I know there's, like, the new Applin or whatever, but... I don't know if I need one of these to evolve it to the new one. I assume so. So I'll just hold on to this until later. Because I caught one originally or I traded for one, but I don't fucking think I have one in my box, so. There you go. He's an apple. I wonder how the new evolution works. I assume it's just an item like the other two. Um, These are all going in the right box, right? Yeah, okay. Oh. Were you in the main game? I don't even remember who was in the main fucking game and who wasn't. I don't know if you were in the main game. Uh, Fomantis was. Okay. I have to... Oh, wait. Can I, like, lock onto him, too, and he'll let me know so I don't have to run into all of them? Let me... Oh, okay. I can't do that yet. Oh, Bellsprout! Poggers! Hey, man. Can you do a prediction if we find a shiny or not? Oh, if you want, I guess so, yeah. I also don't know what, like, some of these shiny Pokemon look like, so it's very realistic that I could just walk by one. Because there's no, like, you know, chime or anything. Oh, Sentrid over there. No matter what Bellsprout is doing, it if it detects movement nearby, it will immediately react by reaching out with its thin vines. Oh, could you fuck off? 
This thing is like up my ass. Get away from me. How do you lock on with Pokemon? Oh, just left trigger. Well, there was a Sentret over here. You know what? I think I'll find another one. It's fine. God, there's just so much, like... I forgot how much bullshit there is to just pick up in this game. Uh, it, it was the rare spot. <laughs> I've already walked by 16 shinies. Yeah, they actually up the shiny rate in this game. It's actually one, one in every three Pokemon. This Pokemon is extremely cautious. Its supple tail... Why are you using supple there? Is well-muscled and firm to touch. Hell yeah. Alright. Um, what is my XP candy situation? Um, can't you, like... This, there's a way to go down by... Oh, okay. I have a good amount of... <laughs> okay. I have a good amount of candy. Never mind. We're fine. I could I could evolve stuff if I need to. How do you go down by? You can like go down to like chunks in this game. Doesn't matter. Who cares? I guess I played this game more than I thought. Whammy. How'd I get a lot of candy? I have no idea. I think just from doing raids, honestly. Also, just walking around the game, you get a lot of shit. But, um... Yeah, I think just doing raids... Mainly, like, I did a bunch of event raids. It, it can freely detach its jaw to swallow huge prey. Hole, it can become too heavy to move, however. Sure, man. I assume you never leveled any Pokemon with candy. Uh, not really. A lot of the Pokemon I used, I just kind of... Used all the way throughout. You know? Wait, go back up. What do you... Can I... Can I lock up? What? Can I? All right. I want to lock on more. Let me. Me and Shu. Where's this foo? This is foo. Me and Xiao is the bigger one. Nice. In fights, they dominate with onslaughts of flowing, continuous attacks with their sharp claws. I don't see any claws there at all. It looks like little nubbins. They cut enemies. All right. They have, like, their hand like this. Oh, hey, Rockruff. Do I need you for this dex? No, I don't. They're retractable. Is a living dex still a thing? No, I was working on it for a while, and I started working on a living deck for this game as well. And then I'm like, I can't fucking play this game. So I stopped playing this game. Grubbin! Dude, grubbin these nuts? Boop, boop, boop. Oh, Charger Bug's right there. How convenient. <laughs> Grubbin normally live underground, but if they get unearthed by Hoot Hoot, they may be found gathered around electric Pokemon. Yeah, dude. We have a, uh... We have a shiny Vikavolt in... Uh, we got it in Sword and Shield, I believe, so... Great shiny. 
Actually, I think this whole line has a good shinies. I know Charger Bug does. Panda, thank you for the seven. Asol, Ed Parkin. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Yeah, Vika Vault with, like, the silver and green. Uh, protected by a sturdy shell, Charger Bug eats large quantities of fresh and decomposing leaf litter in order to evolve. I guess I don't really need, uh, Grubbin anymore. <laughs> Bling. Be free. Goodbye, friend. Fucking look at Mankey creeping over there. Hi, Riolu. I don't know why I'm trying to catch you. You were in the main game. I just saw Riolu and got excited. So cute. Uh, all right, what else is over here? This is why this playthrough is going to take more than one day because I'm d doing this. Oh, great. Timber sweat. My fucking favorite. Can't you climb walls in this game too? Or some, some shit? Maybe it's like some walls. Maybe I'm making that up. Oh, I think you can. I think this is just the edge of the map maybe. Uh... Yeah, that's the edge of the map, I think. Yeah, okay, that's why you can't climb it. Oh, hey, Munchlax. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, this fucking... Controls. Hey, buddy. Yeet! I'm really trying to seek its break the DLC. I'm just trying to remember how to fucking move in this game. He's so little. Kind of crazy that Snorlax wasn't in the base game. It needs to consume its own weight and food every day. As far as flavor it's con is concerned, it's indifferent. Hell yeah. Live your life, Munchlax. The big eater. Does the game run better than it does at launch? You're, you're out of your mind if you think that would happen. A Pokemon game that gets actually updated? No. It uh, still runs like dog shit. But the boxes load faster. So there's that. Uh, let me see what this raid is, I guess. Oh, actually, let me get this guy. Oops. Big dog on campus. Thank you, Tim, for the five months. Let's go. They faithfully follow the orders of their leader. Uh, prey targeted by Mightyena is never allowed to escape the outstanding teamwork of its pursuers. Yeah, dude. They follow you till you're fucking dead. The end. No, I didn't get the Mewtwo yet, but I'm also not going to get the Mewtwo. I think I have two in Pokemon Home, so... I'm uh, not too interested in it. All right, what do we got here? Arceus! Is this um? Uh, is this is this Basca Legion? No, is this Wishy Wash. What the fuck is this? Is this Wishy Washy? Or Basca Legion? Uh, I, it's a fire type, right? Wait, can I just, still just use my like? Wait, where are you? What box did I put you in? Dude, Belly Drum Aqua Jet. Let's see if that still works. Haven't used this in a while. <laughs> it's Pikachu! Let's see how these how these run. Oh, I think I need to put autosave back on too. Hello, Eno. On his Basque Legion. Oh, you set up Rain Dance? Oh, what a sweetie.
Blooby, thank you so much. Someone just decided to bring their horse. Yeah. Basque Legion. This fucking game. <laughs> I oh my god. That's all right, bitch. I got priority. I'm just letting it rip. You don't know any of these Pokemon? Not even Sylveon? Dude, Azu is from Gen 2. Hitacar, think of the Prime Gaming sub. Is this live? Yeah, it went live uh, last night. Mudsdale is from Gen 5, maybe? Haxorus is Gen 5, Sylveon is Gen 6, and uh, Oz is from Gen 2. Basco Legions is from this gen. I, Mudsdale might be later, honestly. I'm not 100% sure where Mudsdale is from. Oh, seven, yeah. That's actually way later than I thought. I was going to say maybe six. Haxorus is my favorite shiny. Haxorus looks so cool. But he's just overshadowed by all the other good Dragon-type Pokemon. Oh my god, I got an Herba Mystica! Sick. That never happens. Of course, I don't give a shit about over Mystic anymore, and they're like, oh, here you go. It's f fucking, of course. What's that do? You use Herba Mystica when you make sandwiches in this game to, like, essentially guarantee you shinies. Basca Legion. This Pokemon is cloaked in the souls of its comrades who perished during a punishing journey to the river of their birth. I think I have a shiny Basculin. Actually, do I have a shiny one of those in PLA? I might. I honestly don't fucking remember. Um, I'm going to put autosave on just in case. I think I have autosave off because of shiny hunting, but put autosave on now. Oh, you can climb. Okay. Uh, 69, 69. A tip on this stream? I'll read it in one second. Anything else interesting over here? Mankey doing his little Mankey dance. All right. Um, there's a low tad over here. Now right, let's go this way. Uh, Krillia. Fucking Squovet. Okay. Oh, sorry. You can just avoid trainers in this. I forgot that's like their whole thing. Bell Sprout, Starlies, Ekans, Pichu. Bro, watch it. Um, okay, we're almost there. Just fucking dog. Uh, Aesil. Hey, Ray, I turned 30 years old tomorrow. Uh, also going through a bit of a tough time. I want to say thank you for all the years of laughs and content. Yo, happy early birthday. Thank you for the 69.69. And uh, sorry you're going through some tough times, man. But hopefully, this stream helps out. Rotom phone apps, huh? You're a traveling app developer. Ooh, a new feature. Uh, 
Oh, okay. You could change the upper and lower frames of the... Okay. Oh, the Pikachu one was kind of cute. Technology really is incredible. Boy, is it. Alright, so that's the sign, I assume. Welcome. Alright, so I have to take a picture with that sign. Anything else over here? That's a stick. All right. Now we have to figure out how to use the camera. I'm an adult virgin. All right, no need to name call. I'll figure it out. What does this say? That's the first sign born. Or born, not born. Chaos and pizza. Thank you. Sorry, did I startle you? I did mention that I'd hang back and follow you here. We're supposed to read the signboard, right? Yes. I already know the whole story. Go ahead. You should check it out. Okay. Why is it written vertically in moon runes? Long, long ago, there was a fearsome ogre. <gasps> Shrek. In the land of Kitakami. The ogre made its home in the mountain behind the village, frightening all who ventured there. One day, the ogre came down from the mountain in a terrible rage, causing great fear in the village. By some stroke of luck, Okie Doki, Monkey Dory, and Fen Fenzadipity all happened to be there as well. The three Pokemon laid down their lives to fend off the ogre and send it back to the mountain. In admiration, the people of the village bestowed upon this brave trio the title, The Loyal Three. Uh, their remains were given a proper burial and statues of the three were erected above the site. The Loyal Three Monument is right over there. But don't you think the ogre in that folktale sounds kind of cool? It sure does. I knew you'd get it, Ray. It was up against three uh, whole opponents at once battling out all by itself. Wowzers, that's so cool. But I guess most people would just think an ogre like that is scary, huh? I don't think there's any reason to be afraid. Yeah, I've seen Shrek. When I was little, I went up into the mountain so many times at night all on my own. I never once met that ogre. <laughs> Only scary thing that happened was the grown-ups giving me a real earful about it. So yeah, we're supposed to take a photo in front of the signboard, right? I don't have a smartphone, could you? I could certainly try. Oh, it does it automatically. Thank God. Why does he look terrified? Turned out great. You're even good at taking photos. Thanks. Sorry, not trying to butter you up or anything. You know, I didn't want to have to come to do the school trip thing, but well, it was kind of fun. Mm -hmm. Nature, hometown, talk to me. Yeah, I got it. Bro, are you hitting on me? Would you like a sandwich? Oh, I don't have a choice. Oh. What is that thing? Some kind of kaiju or something? This is my ride. It's called Karidon. called Coridon, and you ride it, huh? I've never seen another Pokemon like this. And it seriously comes out whenever it hears the word sandwich? Yes. Never thought I'd actually get to meet such an awesome Pokemon. No wonder you're so strong, Ray. You're, you're special. Chad, I'm special. So the next, we should go find the next signboard, Kitakami Hall. Kitakami Hall is, well, first double back to town from here. Yep, uh, yep, mm-hmm. I'll just check it on the map. Thanks. You fucking scared him. Way to go, idiot. Alright. Um... Oh. I forgot what these mean. We could fast travel though, right? We could just fly. Okay, I'm sick. Nathan, thank you for the six. Dude, wait till Kiki finds out sandwiches are fucking busted. The hell was that? Oh, that's a polywag. It's a big ass polywag. Q. 
keep grabbing all this shit even though I'm not going to use it. Reveler's Road. Alright, what do we got over here? <laughs> Cricket Todd's so tiny. Pachirisu, world champ. Vulpix. How loud, is, how loud is my switch right now? I have no idea. It is like a launch switch, so it's probably screaming in pain. Foul play. Thank you for the 23. Oh, yeah. There you go. Look, it matches my phone. That's why my phone is green. I have, like, the Let's Go skin on it that has, like, the classic... Pikachu and Eevee, like, like, look, if it's attacked by an enemy that is stronger than itself, it feigns injury to fool the enemy and escapes. Oh, it plays possum. It's like, why the fuck is my shit green? Aerocross. Hey, man. Centered again. Was Stantler in the base game? It was. Oh, it's for it. Hi, Jamie. Thank you, Crow. Yeah. My floating quick ball. It raises its offspring inside a long, narrow nest. Once they're old enough, it takes them outside the nest to prepare them for independence. Kicks him out of the fucking house. All right. We don't need Sentried anymore. Oh, I guess I could evolve my... Um, Vulpix as well, right? Oh, you guys are in the wrong box. Whoopsie. Uh, oh my god, how the fuck do you do it in this game? Was it like... Was it this? There we go. That's how you do it. Yeah, dude. All right. Be free. All right, uh, Vulpix. If I don't have a Firestone, I'd be so surprised. But I also don't remember where it would be. Oh, I, I know my alphabet. Oh, yeah, I do. Sick. Actually, I only have two. I thought I'd have more. Some legends claim that each of its nine tails has its own... Okay, I hit A on accident. Sick. All right. All right, let's keep looking around. Uh, Flap, flap, flap. Oh, we checked Stantler already, yeah. Uh... Oh my god, it just it's so choppy. Oh, okay. Oh, hey, spinner rack. I didn't see you there, buddy. El Bleezy, what's going on? Nine tails or Arcanine? Arcanine? Um, they're both really good. I don't know. That's a that's a tough call. They both have other forms too. I'll probably go. I think I go nine tails. I give it the slight edge. But our canine is also kind of sick. There's Stantler fucking off. The nub. Oh, that means we can get a uh, Ray Romano. We have to evolve this into Pylo Swine, and then Pylo Swine needs to be have like ancient power or some shit. I've some of these evolutions I'm gonna have to look up in on Cerebi. Debra. 
It searches for food by digging into the ground with its snout. Even frozen ground doesn't give it trouble. Oh, it's, even like loading in the book for the Pokedex is just lags. Oh my god. I'll tell you what, we really are spoiled by ROM hacks. Oh, Ducklet! Is Ducklet the main game? It wasn't! We can get Swana? The Karen Bird? Ducker Z! Does this lag more or less than the Switch version of Spongebob Krusty Cook-Off? They're, they're, they're pretty equal. It's not very good at flying yet. It watches the dances of its swan parents to learn how to move its wings. What a cutie. Pop. Alright, there's a timber over there. Alright, timber right there. What else is over here? It's a fairy-type Pokemon. Please. Uh, ooh, a fairy type Chandelure. Do I have a steel type to deal with that? I guess I have Tinkaton, which could work. Um, I guess we could try. Eh, fuck it, we'll try, why not? Yeah, dude. Hit it with the big ol' hammer. Hammer bunk. A poison type probably would be better because of um, my weakness to fire. But we'll see how this goes. I don't think I have a poison type ready. I also don't remember Shandalore was in the base game. <laughs> Titan, thank you for the 16. Chandelure's not in the base game. Okay. Great Pokemon. That did negative damage. Uh-oh. Yeah, and you need a poison type for this. I'm not sure if that crit mattered. Chandelure's a really cool Pokemon. I love the design. I love the shiny. And it's actually not too bad. It will be interesting to see how it does in this, like, um, meta with Terra. See if it makes it, like, any better or anything like that. I wonder if I can use this again. Because I died. Oh, I can. But yeah, I don't think it matters. I think, I think we're going to wipe here. Did the crit matter? Oh, it did. I forgot we could run. Goodbye, friend. Actually, I wonder if, um... Oh, maybe not, because that's Shadow Ball. I was going to say, maybe I could use Slowbro and kind of stack, like, uh, buffs for stored power, but Shadow Ball might do a lot. All right, where's that Timber? Oh, normal Growlithe. Hey, buddy. Oh. Are you in the fucking base game? Anyway. We got to see Growlithe. I think that Timber despawned. Whoops. Oh no, he's over here. Where's this girder? This is girder, because he's holding the girder. Timber is the small one. And then, uh... uh what's the name of the final four? Conkleder. That's all veiny. Ugh. Why is he so veiny? Novi, thank you for the 89. Thank you, thank you. 
Do you know why? Yeah, I guess I do know the answer to that question. Uh, they strengthen their bodies by carrying steel beams. They show off their big muscles to their friends. I guess he, Girder's also kind of veiny. Like, he's getting there. Uh, what else we got here? Oh, wow. They're, oh, the whole fucking line is here. All right. Guess I can catch all of them to make it faster. Swadloon. I love Swadloon. It's just a cozy emote. It's just covered in a blanket. It just wants to chill. What a great design. And then uh, there's Mommy in the background that we're going to get. Swadloon lives quietly at the feet of trees. He prefers eating fallen leaves that have grown soft rather than fresh ones. And likes to be snuggled in a blanket. Ooh, one level off. One level off. Yeet! Nice. Hey, so Yanma was still the hardest Pokemon to catch so far. <laughs> this gentle Pokemon has strong protective instincts. The leaves on its arms are sharp enough to slice a thick tree in half with one stroke. Jesus. I can fix her. All right. I guess we can uh, release release the babbies. Be free. Hopefully, I don't need them for any any reason. Whoops. Oh, there's our buck. Cherry berry. Oh, C dot. Was C dot in the main game? Living deck says hi. That's true. That's a very good point. I guess I could just, like, make eggs and stuff, but that's effort. To expand its habitat, it pretends to be a nut. So that bird Pokemon will pick it up and carry it far away. Oh. <laughs> that's how they move. Birds are their U-Haul. How did I get the that thing on my phone? Uh, there was like a, a phone guy by the first story location. I just talked to him and he did that for me. It matches the phone case I have. And I think you get the phone case from... You talk to someone in the main game that... If you have save files for older Pokemon titles, they give you more phone cases, I believe. The pattern on its belly appears to be a frightening face. Weak foes will flee just at the side of the pattern. Guys, it's Cobra backwards. What? I know, dude. Sorry to blow your mind. All right, what else we got over here? Growlithe. I ran into the snake I didn't even see. Hey, buddy. All right. Anything else over here? Heal powder. Cutie fly is so little. Oh, please just run slightly better. Yeah, Ekans is, uh, Ekans is little. You little boy. Ooh. Oh, ill. that's a... Uh, Illamize fluid? Wait, what? What do you mean? What fluid did I just pick up?
Did you just ever pick up this weird bug fluid? Anyway, we got Timber. We got his sweat. Speaking of fluid. Always carrying squared logs. They help out with construction. As they grow, they carry bigger logs. <laughs> Alright. Let me dump him. Robbie Rotten! Rest in peace! 11,111 bits. Dude, bits are dumb and no one's gonna use them. Oh, hey, Ariados. Uh, by Captain Hauser. No comment. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. New bit badge as well. Hell yeah. Dude, first time we've seen some of these alerts in a long time. Let's go. Huge. A single strand of a special thread is endlessly spun out of its rear. The thread leads back to its nest. They buffed the hell out of him with a cool new attack. Unless they gave Ariados like 200 more BST. I think it's not going to be usable. Unless the attack is like completely overpowered. But it is still Ariados. What a cool Pokemon. Alright, what's in here? Oh, this is, uh, the fucking Gen 7, uh, pseudo-legendary. Uh, electric type, huh? What can we use here? I might be able to get away with just using Skeledurge, honestly. Yeah, I'll just try using Skeledurge. I don't know why I have Terra Blast on here with Terra Fire. Anyway. They gave it a new signature move, Toxic Thread, which is just String Shot that causes poison. Does it also lower speed? If it's speed drops and poison, that's pretty good. Is it like Toxic Poison, or is it just like, is it shit poison? Dude, the fucking light bulb's bigger than this guy. Jang Mo, oh, that's his name. Oh, he's got soundproof. Fuck. He's already dead, so it doesn't matter. Don't worry, guys, I'm helping. I'm helping. Do you see there's a state of play tomorrow? There's a PlayStation state of play as well? On top of the Nintendo one? Damn. What time's the state of play? Two PM? Fuck me. We are going to be busy tomorrow. What the fuck is Sony going to announce? Dude, maybe at the Sony State of Play, they'll release Mario Party 3 on the Switch. Huh? Maybe? Probably more price increases. All right, yeah, we'll watch that too. How long is it supposed to be? Does it say in the post? Uh, the post uh, the post scrolled by. Because I know the, the Mario... Or the Mario one. The Nintendo one's supposed to be like 40 minutes. Oh, here it is. Oh, it doesn't say. Focused on Indian third-party titles. Alright, so we have the... Sony State of Play at fucking 4 p.m. Central and then 9 a.m. Central for the Nintendo one. That's going to be interesting.
we will watch both. I will, without a doubt, forget the times, so. I'll have to, before the stream is over, or um, after the stream, rather, I'll have to write it down and set, set alarms. The carp! Polywag slime. Ew. What? Oh. Hey, Barboach. How's it going, buddy? Ah, Surskit! Ah! Anything else in here? Oh, there might be something over here, actually. Or is this like something for later? I stop picking up fluid, you freak! It's me. I'm the freak. I'm controlling what I pick up. I think there's a weeping bell over here as well, but whatevs. Big boy Heracross, hello, hello. Another Heracross, you love that. Oh my god. Spinarak. I can't even I can't even see what this is. Uh Oh, hey these guys. I I what are you? I literally still can't see what this is. Oh! Oh, hey. Okay. It's the new one. <laughs> Fucking couldn't see it at all. Something new. Let's go. Uh, Wolf Storm. Was that always an issue, not being able to run straight forward? I don't know. Um, because my controller works in every other direction. And it works when I'm on Coridon. So I have no idea. Poltergeist! Yeah, dude. Jumbo, Kali plays, thank you for the resubs. Uh, counterfeit form. Oh, that's cool. It tells you there. Supposedly, the regrets of a tea ceremony master who died before perfecting his craft lingered in some matcha and became a Pokemon. I like his back scratcher. Ooh, does it evolve? I guess that makes sense, right? Because it's Poltergeist and Poltergeist evolves. Or, I guess, Sinisty evolves, however the fuck that works. Liquidation. All right, what do we got in here? We got... Oh, it's just a basculine. I don't want to really do that right now. Um, oh, we got to go to the left. Let's go! Oh, look at the poly world just swimming. Hey, man. Oh, we got, uh, th uh, this fucking guy. We got more homies over here. Corefish. That's his name. Pokemon drops DLC right after I sold the Switch? I mean, they announced this DLC, like, a long time ago. I think that's on you. It came from overseas. It is a very hardy creature that will quickly proliferate even in polluted streams. That's nasty, man. Do that shit at home. Welcome to the no. Dude, welcome to the no. There's Poliwag right there. Weeping Bell. I'll get you later, homies. 
Time to scale this mountain. Okay. Almost there. Almost there. Oop. I'm here. Easy. Soon. Is that a threat? Oh, this is cool. This is a cute little, like, festival thing. Oh, okay, there you go. That's what to say. Fucking Snorlax just on the ground over there. <laughs> Did you know about Snorlax? Snorlax is known as a sleeping Pokemon. Pretty clear where that category comes from. My man just flopped out on, like, these rocks. Dude, he eepy. All right, before I go talk to you, what's back here? Paralyze heal. Helping hands. There's the sign over there. Hey, man. Okay. Just enjoy yourselves. I will with a lore dump. Hey, man. Time to read the sign. The ogre possessed four mysterious glimmering masks. It is said that, depend, that depending on the mask the ogre donned, the powers of its cudgel would change. Gross. When wearing the teal mask, that's the name of the DLC, it could bring life back into withered greenery around it. When wearing the crimson mask, it could turn a candle's flame into a raging inferno. When wearing a blue mask, it could stop the very flow of a river. When wearing the ashen gray mask, it could easily break the hardest stone in two. Before the loyal three fell, they rested away, three of the ogre's mask greatly weakening it. Cool. I did read it. The masks the Loyal Three stole are kept over at Kitakami Hall. Everyone in town is scared of the ogre, but me, I really like it. All right, not Majora. It was strong and cool, didn't even care when everyone shunned it. Yeah, this is actually just the Skull Kid. This is a crossover. I wanted to be as cool as the ogre. My sister sort of ends up doing everything for me, even when we're at school. I want to try to get stronger so I can do things for myself, you know? I'm going to become someone people can rely on. Then just maybe I could be that ogre's friend. Uh, right, picture. We're supposed to take a picture. Yeah, I'll take the next one, too. Ah! The kid is Shrek-pilled. <laughs> The dreaded den. Oh, shit. I want to see it. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Infernal Pass, whatever. I just want to go catch some Pokemon. How does his hair stay, stay like that? I don't know. Got like... His bangs are OP. All right. Uh, Let's go. Shout to the random Hoot Hoot over there. Don't sparse! Let's go! Oh, mouse hold. Or tandem mouse, whichever one that was. My breadstick, first time chatter. Hello, welcome on in. Bonsley. That's Pichu. Timber over there. Anything in the water? Nope, just the carpet looks like. Fling! Ooh, where does this lead? 
This is probably a mistake. It's gonna lead down, but... Is there a little secret over here? <gasps> Yo, Lotad! Pog! It was worth it! How long is Pokemon DLC normally? Uh, like a few hours. Like, if, if I focused the story and ignored, like, exploring, I could probably wrap it up in, I don't know, maybe, like, three hours, four hours? Depending on, like, cutscenes and shit, but I'm just, like, walking around and catching stuff. The Waterweed Pokemon. Yo, <laughs> I toke up, dude. Pop. Oopsies. A lot of, lot of carps over here. A lot, lot of magic carps. Jesus, I'm like underwater. Nothing on this little platform, huh? All right, yeah, I think that's just Lotad and uh, magic carp spawns. Hey, Gligar. This is the complete opposite way I'm supposed to go, but. Eh. Crawdunt. This is why the game is lagging? Oh, because of all the Magikarp? Yeah. Loving to battle, this Pokemon pinches all Pokemon that enter its territory with its pincers and throws them out. <laughs> okay. Hey, my bird. Let's go. Cramorant. The Cheeto bird. One of my uh, first shinies in Gen 8. Cramorant is significantly swallow everything whole. They're at their most formidable when they're struggling to swallow overly large prey. The gulp Pokemon. Oh, is that a version exclusive? What does, um... What does Violet have in its place? Oh, Morpico! Forgot all about Morpico. He gets hangry. Alright, I'll have to trade that later. I'll trade my cram Cramorant. You'll save one for me? Okay. Um, I'll try and find another Cramorant. If not, it's no big deal because I have it on the... Okay, well, I found a fucking gang of them. Never mind. <laughs> Guys, am I going to get jumped? Oh, right, yeah. Okay. I'll trade you one for uh, your more Pico later. Gang, gang. Gang, gang. Gang, gang. Mmm. So good. Yum, yum. Blink. All right. It's going to keep telling me to reclaim my reward for the Pokedex, but I don't fucking remember how to do that, so... <laughs> I'll do that at some point. But if you're wondering why I haven't redeemed it, I do see it. I just don't remember how that works. All right, let's see. There's Riolu. I think I saw a Gligar on the way down, but I got distracted. Rock Ruff. Um, what is this? Oh, it's just a little duck. Are you shiny? No, no, no. Okay. I actually don't know what's shiny. The shiny... Duck it looks like. It just looks like a different color. That was just like the, um... When I saw the Frost Moth, I wasn't sure if it was shiny, and it happened to be. But yeah, I have no idea what shiny duck it looks like. I actually think it, it might be an obvious color, but, like, I, I think it might be a pink shiny. But I could be making that up. Oh! You! 
Right. I forgot what you're called. Follow me. Then you evolve into the vulture. They tend to guard their uh, posteriors with suitable bones they have found. They pursue weak Pokemon. Nice, Mr. Wolfwood. Glad you enjoyed the story. Oh my god, there's so many ducks here. Oh, this guy. Choodle. Hey, Choodle. Thank god you can lock on a Pokemon to see if you caught him already, because I don't remember... As you've heard, I don't know. I don't remember what Pokemon were in the main game. Um. Bombardier, that thing's called, right? Yeah, Bombardier. Shit. Yeah, dude. Icy Gecko, thank you for the fifty-four. Uh, what is this thing? Oh, Aracuda. There's Pooper. Or Whooper, rather. Sorry. Oh, just fucking raw Gyarados over there. Do I have... Oh, I guess I don't have these in this Pokedex. So... Alright, I'll grab them now. Since I'm in the neighborhood. It's Jorts! Oh my god, the Quagsire right behind me just staring at me. A transparent mucous membrane covers its body. Touching, its, touching it barehanded will cause a tingling numbness. Oh, you could touch the whooper and then perform the stranger on yourself. Nice. Hey, buddy. You're next. Tom Fox. Should have bought more quick balls. Hell yeah. This carefree Pokemon has an easygoing nature. While swimming, it always bumps into boat holes. Or hulls, excuse me, not holes. What a silly guy. The sire has indeed been acquired. Ooh, what's in here? Little hidey hole. Fucking Starly, get out of the way. Are you going to be blocking it? Is that is that what's going to happen right now? Okay. Hydro pump! It was worth it! Oh, fuck. Choodle. Goddamn big head. I was trespassing in that Starly's house. I took his shit and left. I am a menace. Um, oh, there's the Gligar from earlier. Hey, buddy. What's up, Honey Tweed? Okay, I... Uh... <laughs> Why is he so close? I'm, like, running him over. This is... This is... What a game. What a game. <laughs> what a fucking game. All right, my Pokemon's behind me. Hey, come back. Go, Breloom. Go. All right. Hey, this thing loves me too much. Good. Gligar is the only other version exclusive? Oh, what does uh, Violet get?
Apom. Oh, a quick snooze. All right, so Gligar needs... Isn't Gligar a trade with uh, Razor Claw? Ooh, Crab Hammer. Oh, hey. Fucking... Oh, that's right. He expels the poison. No, I want him to stay poisoned. That's right. This is why Toxic Orb doesn't work, because the stupid love mechanic. Razor Fang at night. Okay. The love mechanic is so bad. I wish you could toggle it. There's a lot of things I wish you could toggle in these games. You could toggle it in Lumi Platinum. Yep, expelled the poison. I'm poisoned again. Sick. Are you fucking joshing me right now? Can you stop being a bitch? Should just use my master ball. Braylum is just staring into Karidon's asshole. Get in the flask. I guess I could use an Ultra Ball. I just keep using Pokeballs for aesthetic. Thank you. Yeah, I'm not really throwing it. It's like I'm going to throw it, but I bobble it. Anyway, we got it. Sick. It builds its nest on a steep cliff. When it is done gliding, it hops around the ground back to its nest. All right. Cool. Okay. I guess we'll get back on our path here that we're supposed to go. Slugma, what, dude? I don't know Slugma was in this. Hey, Vulpix, you're going to end it all? All right, Godspeed, do a flip. Oh, what's that cave over there? Was that a cave, or was that like a broken section of this? Oh, no, it's a cave. I found a mass outbreak of Wild Cleffa. Did I? It might be outside this little mountain. Or unless it's in here. What did I pass? Oh, hey, Snow Runt. Um, can I guess I can't lock onto you? Fuck you, I guess. Oh, oh, get... He's... He's cl... Thank you. Jesus. There's the Dunsparce. Let me catch you. <laughs> Love this game. <laughs> it's so good. Wham! It, j it just works. Okay, this thing is gonna, like, end itself. Run away. I can't really do my spore thing if you're just going to take down and kill yourself in game. Don't make me waste quick balls. I'm trying one more. If not, I'll kill you myself in game. Hell yeah. Look how good the floor texture looks zoomed in. What was that, like 4K, you think? Covered by a shaggy coat, is it is resistant to the cold. It, its tusks of ice thicken when it snows.
Oh shit. They need me to jump. Alright, what's up here? Snow runts. Sligoo! Um, let's see. Nope, not the snow runt. Oh, it's Gumi. Sligoo's the second one. Fake fan. Oh, hey, Dunsparce. Oh, no, it's... Oh, it's the this thing! The Coom! Tynamo. Didn't even see you. Alright, before we go down, is there anything over here? Is this just an exit? Oh, hey, man. I'm gonna take this. My dive ball. See ya. <laughs> you guys ever just rob a pile of swine? Hey, Sneasel. Oh, this is just... Okay, this is just where I was, but... I just went another way. Snow runts. Uh, what the fuck? Oh, Carbink! Jesus Christ. Any Carbink stands in chat? OMG me. <laughs> ah, bitch. I think it's like rock... Fairy? Is that Carping's typing? Car Carpinks! <laughs> Misa Rock and Fairy type! Can you stop being a cuck? He still love taking balls, dude. <laughs> uh, how much does false swipe do? I know it's not very effective, but you're mainly defensive type Pokemon, right? Yeah. Okay. So, do you have any moves that damage yourself? Okay, we might be able to just whittle this down slowly. Breloom has had Poison Heal since, I think it's Inception. Oh, you got Moonblast. All right, well, fuck me. It, at the very least, got it in Gen 4. Because I remember uh, that being a big thing in Gen 4. But it's had it for a very long time. There's not many po many Pokemon with Poison Heal. It's this. It's uh, Gliscor. That's all I can think of. That might be it. Uh, I guess we can. Aesthetics, baby. I feel like uh, the one-up nickname for Breloom is pretty common. Because, I mean, I did that in Gen 4 as well, but I feel like... Like, it's not a creative name by any means. It just, you know... Reminds me of what the one I had as a kid. Okay. Um... Oh, boy. I want that TM. I don't think it really matters, but I... Uh, wait. Oh, okay. I'm going to go all the way around for this TM. I'm not going to... Yep. Oh, yep. Got it. Maybe. Oh my god, please. Oh my god, land on the platform. Land on the platform. Let's go! Oh, Thunderbolt at least is a good one. For all those competitive battles I do on cart. Uh, let's see. Quagsire, Magikarp, Aracuda. What else is over here? 
Uh, oh. Blizzard. Ghost Terror Shards. Could you... He's in the way. Oh, that's completely different Pokemon. Tynamo, I love you. I don't need you. Gyarados, please don't hit me immediately. Gumi. Oh, here we go. Great. I'm going to Dragon Pulse into my own asshole. <laughs> Ooh, level 69. Oh, Astro Tyler. Hell yeah, man. Thank you so much for watching that. Have a safe drive from uh, from work. You guys ever just ass blast yourself? All right, thanks, Tropius. You know what, Tropius? You've been out a bunch. The mascot Dole. Let's get the big doofy worm out. Give me or Orthworm. Also have a shiny one of him some somewhere. He was one of the six Pokemon I got shiny that one day where we like actually I learned how to use sandwiches properly. And I'm like, oh my god, shiny hunting in this game is a joke. But it's pretty awesome at the same time. Uh, and then we're back over here. Cool. Alright, so, uh... We gotta go... Way over here. Okay. Guess Graveler's over there as well in Geo, dude. The camera in the cave is giving you motion sickness? Yeah, I get that. I mean, look at the camera when I'm, like, jumping. It doesn't know what to do. Almost there. Question mark. What's happening here? Who knows? Oh, I never found those Cleffa. Or was it Clefairy? That there was like an outbreak of. <laughs> Come on. Almost there. Yep. God, thank God you could scale walls in this game. All right, we're here. Honey, I'm home. Oh, hey, man. Do you have trouble getting across that narrow path? What narrow path? <laughs> I climbed over a mountain. <laughs> this is the ogre's home. At least that's what everyone says. Uh, I come here all the time, but I've never seen it. <laughs> Maybe a powerful ogre like that uh, would only show up if I heard some kind of battle going on. Oh, do you want to battle? Oh, sure, man. Let's battle. Thanks for healing up my Tropius. What a hero. Uh, little Bambi Joe, Jake Jones, Gecko. Thank you for the resubs, gifted subs. Chris as well. Hiki. Appreciate you. Oh, you evolved your fucking Sentry. I'm so proud of you. Scotty Too Hotty. That name probably wouldn't fit for this Orthworm. Scott Too Hot. Pepe Laffy doesn't know. He's gonna heal me. Or I could just do that. Got him. Polywhirl. No fear. Oh, he's dancing. Oh, 
I'm a, I'm a steel type, right? I'm pure steel? Yeah, okay. Just earthquake here. He's doing the bootleg gritty. Yanma. God, I have no special defense. <laughs> I have less now. This should one shot though. But that was just one attack. Oh man, it did so much damage. Yeah, idiot, you're four times weak to it. Also, I'm like 15 levels higher than you. He did it, the Alaskan Bullworm! Oh man, I lost. Sorry, dude. I knew it, you really are strong, Ray. How am I ever going to be able to beat you? If the ogre saw that battle, I'm sure he'd be thinking, that kid's got real strength. See, my school, Blueberry Academy. It's a school that specializes in teaching the art of Pokemon battling. Uh, if I was as strong as you, maybe I could aim to be the best trainer there. Let's go have a look at the ogre's den. All right. Kid, I don't mean to beat you down, but I have to for story reasons. <gasps> Shaman! Watch your head. See how dark it is in here and cramped? Even the floor is all rough and uneven. Living all alone in a place like this would get pretty miserable, don't you think? Poor ogre. We have plenty of room in our house. I would have totally let it stay with us. When can I move in? I don't know if we'd have a room for the both of you, Ray. Okay, idiot. I meant instead of the ogre. But if the ogre really did show up to stay at our place, I'm sure the whole town would freak. Well, no way. The sun's already going down. I guess we'll have to save the last signboard for tomorrow. Oh, I almost forgot. Today's the first day of the Festival of Masks over at Kitakami Hall. It's this big event where everyone puts on masks and run around celebrating. I mean, it's not like you've got to go or anything, but if you wanted to, you know, check it out. It'd be fun. Let's go together. Yeah, why not? It'd be great to go together. Hey, this isn't a, like a date or anything. This is just for story progression. You gotta swing by your house, alright. Northwest corner of the village. Uh, I could draw a map. Or oh, just add it to my phone. Oh, uh, you see, there's my phone case. Look at the little Pikachu and little Eevee. I love the phone case. The green's kind of an ugly color. But I like the, uh, that's the let's go phone case. Sure is handy having a map like that. Shows everything on your phone. Yeah, it's even more handy if you know how to open it. Use the PLA one. Oh, the, uh, the Arceus phone. I think the green is supposed to simulate the, yeah, like the OG, like, Game Boy colors. Oh, right. Magikarp's fucking dumb face with his lips. I hate that Magikarp. Um, I guess there's more I can explore, but I could go back. Let me see if I can get to this water thing first before we head back. Yeah, All right. Let's scale this mountain in a second. Oh, okay. I guess I can't go back in there. All right. We're climbing to the top, baby. We're going all the way. And then we'll just fast travel back down. Let's, uh... Let's Skyrim this mountain. Yep. Okay. All right. Yeah, dude. Chat, there's going to be a shiny up here. Look, it'll be totally worth it. Look, uh, d fucking Geo, dude. Let's go. Hey, 
any Geo men. <laughs> What's up, Ivory? At rest, it looks just like a rock. Carol, she's stepping on it, will make it swing its fist angrily. Can you evolve it without trading yet? Oh, to like Golem? I don't think so. Hey, Houndour. Uh, Alright. What's down here? Slugma! What, dude? Slug my dick. Slug my balls. Nice. Alright, what was the other thing here? Coughing? Normal coughing? Its lava body can cool and chip away at times, but a, a magma bath will heal it right up. Slugma looks like it would be <laughs> in Futurama. Yeah, I see that. I, I'm picking up what you're putting down. I swear I saw, you saw a shiny sparkle on Slugma? Slugma shiny is like, like gray, isn't it? It's like very obvious. Yeah, it's like a silver and gray. Nice. Toxic, toxic gas is held within its thin balloon shaped body so it can cause massive explosions. What a cool guy. Nice. Alright. What else is over here? Uh, I don't remember if you were in the game. I did not mean to run into you. You were not. Chingling! Is there really any other Pokeball that's as useful as the Quick Ball? There's an orb inside its mouth. When it hops, the orb bounces all over. makes a ringing sound. There's definitely Pokeballs that look way cooler and, like, aesthetically are more pleasing, but the Quick Ball is just, like, so good. Besides, like, you know, the Master Ball, obviously. Uh, Bronzor. Got that Taco Bell. Glamora's over there. Is that what it's called? Glamora? Glamora, yeah. We have a shiny Glamour already. Oh, this... I don't even know what I hit. Oh. Oh, that... It looks like he hasn't loaded in yet. What the fuck? These are, uh... Definitely graphics, huh? These are... These are... These are graphics. Uh... What's up here? Okay. Hey, it runs much better if I don't look at the water. <laughs> Oh, Glamora. Oh, and that's the, like... Yeah, that's the first form. Glamet. A fighting type, uh... Not Lotad, but whatever evolves into. We don't really need that. Um... Anything else over here? I don't think so. Oh, Litwick. Hey, man. I bought this chat. I'm part of the problem. Oh, don't worry. A lot of us are part of the problem. I pre-ordered this day one knowing it's going to run like dog shit because I'm an idiot. It's flames. Uh, it's flame is usually out, but it starts shining when Litwick absorbs life force from people or Pokemon. It's me. Hi, I'm the problem. It's me. All right. Um, now I think that's like everything over here. Um, yeah, like, when I get to the water, oh, my God. Oh! Gee, I, I, oh, it's like I'm going through, like, mud. Uh, what's this Pokemon over here? Did I check this? 
Oh, it's another one of these guys, but they're ice. The Juicy 5 FPS. All right, we'll, uh, we'll fly back. We'll head back down. We have FPS at home, FPS yeah, at home. Dude. Hold on one second, chat. I'll have you uh, keep looking at cute Nurse Joy. I'm here. Grandpa, I'm home. <laughs> Let's chat when they log into the stream. Welcome home, Kirian. And who's this with you? This is Ray. She's part of the same school trip as me and Sis. Oh, so this is a new friend of yours, eh, Kirian? I sure am. What, really? We're friends? Friends, I feel all tingly and funny hearing that. All right, man, relax. Oh, it's me and Tina. That's me in two years, and that's Tina in about 40 years. We look so cute together still. Thank you for befriending our Kirin here, Ray. Oh, no, it's Paris Parasocial. Ray, this is my grandma. Well, fancy that. A friend of Kirin's. Uh, we're delighted to have you, Ray. Oh, my, is it really already sundown? Goodness, I nearly forgot. The Festival of Mass starts tonight, doesn't it? Come now, Kiki. You too, Ray. I'll get out some Jinbei for you both so you can go to the festival and gussy it up. We're going to dress up. Let's go. You got to do my hair. There we are. All done. Yo, for free? It suits you mighty fine, just as I thought it would. Goodness, it's like I've gained another granddaughter. <laughs> Imagine a stylish young thing like yourself could make good use of this too, Ray. The teal style card. Ooh. Having one of these cards increase the selection. Oh, that's kind of nice. You get more clothing options. I wonder if they're all still bad. Or a majority of them are still bad. Having that card should open up all sorts of new looks for you at the big city shops salons. Oh, dude, I like the blue. What are you doing here? Ray said she'd go to the Festival of Mass with me. Oh, really? Is that so? Uh, what's the matter anyway? What are you doing back here? Oh, right, Grant. I couldn't find my mask for the festival. Oh, the mask, they should be in the shed. I put them there after last year's festival. Uh, it shouldn't be locked, so you three go and have a rummage. See what you find. Okay. First on there wins. I want the Goron one. Please forgive those two, Ray. They can be a bit rambunctious. Whoa. Hard R. Nico Soul Blaster. How you guys doing? Is there anything like else back here? Oh, I guess not. It's just their house in the shed, huh? Okay. Yeah, I have no idea why my fucking stick doesn't work going up. Weird. I'll have to look at that after this. Gotta be another one. I found fewer frames behind the house. I did. Steal their gas tank. Uh, just rolling up like you own the place. Well, it looks like there's only two masks in the shed. I mean, I don't need one. Too bad, right? There's nothing I can do about it. Guess you'll just have to do without a mask, eh? First come, first serve and all that. I mean, that's fine. Don't look so glum. How about... Okay. Okay. Yeah, I guess we can battle. Battle for the mask. All right. If I win, I get Jim Carrey. 
If you lose, you get Jamie Kennedy. There's a lot on the line here. More Pico! I am using the Gilly Kid controller. I was using it literally the other day. And there was no issue with the uh, moving forward on the stick. Are you for real? Cringe? Is this about the mask? Come on, stop with the super effective moves. What do you mean? I did have a sash. You... Bitch. <laughs> At scrub quotes. <laughs> Uh, can I just Iron Head? Fire him! Mighty Anna. I'll stay in. Focus Sash in a mainline game that's not a ROM hack. I've never seen that before. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. Have they done that before? Um, You know, we'll switch out here. Let's bring in... Well, bringing in you would be stupid because it's a dark type, but we haven't used Veluza yet, so let's do it anyway. Globe, thank you for the 46. I'm breaking the mold. Got him. Oh no! Does anyone use Veluza? Not really. I think he looks cool. I think the typing's also kind of nice. Water Psychic isn't used too much. It's used on, like, you know, the slow, slow poke line and Bruxish, among others, but... Yeah, I just thought he looked cool, so... So I used him. Starmie's another one, yeah. Oh! Wait, is this the first form or the second form? Oh, wait, go back. He looks kind of cool. No, don't look at me. Is he wearing a whisk? Looks like he's wearing a whisk. Uh, anyway. We're probably dead here, but... I'll just crunch anyway for funsies. Matcha gotcha. <laughs> that, was a, that was a cool animation. You get health back for that? Yeah, you do. Okay. Oh, yeah. Isn't Filet Away, like... Kind of like Shell Smash for just, um... For Veluza? So that's a draining move that also causes burn. Oh, that's... Jesus, really? <laughs> uh, we'll just hit him with the hammer. Hammer! Tyler, thank you for the 28... Swadloon. I'm going to crush you. Oh, my God. And go to the festival feeling like a winner. Okay, but then why are you picking the cozy Pokemon? This Pokemon doesn't even look like it wants to fight. It's another grass ghost. Needs some to stand out. I feel like... Most, if not all, the Grass Ghost Pokemon look really cool, though. I like their designs a lot. Hopefully it has a good shiny. Hey, you're supposed to be enamored and distracted by my festival style. The only style I get distracted in, Carmine, is Gangnam style. Fuck you. Oh, well, it's not like beating me was... 
Gonna cause another mask to magically appear. Now then, let me get my mask. How's that? Looks good, don't it? Uh, it's okay, Ray. You can just wear my mask. What? No, I already said it's first come, first served. And besides, that's your ogre mask. You've always loved that mask. Yeah, but... No buts about it. Ray could just get her own mask at the festival. She's fine. Now move it. Let's go. I am fine. I look good. Oof. Sorry, Ray. I knew my sis seems kind of harsh, but she's really not all that bad. Actually, she was tearing the shed apart trying to find a third mastery before you got there. Oh, but uh, don't tell her I told you that, Ray. The Festival of Masks is uh, up at Kitakama Hall. We should probably get going. Yeah, all right. Uh, let me heal. We got a little bit of a paralysis, and my Veluza is dead. <laughs> 80s, dude. Thank you for the 53. Will Majuba, Majuba be at the festival? Probably not. I wish, though. How do you relearn moves in this game? Is it like, you check the summary, right? Oh, you change moves. That's right. And you can, like, remember moves. Oh, that's what it is. You boost attack, special attack, and speed, but you are uh, you lose some HP. Ah, okay. That's how you relearn moves. Okay. I'm going to need that later for, like, some evolutions. Cut your HP in half. So it's like, um... Uh, belly drum in that regard. Oh, man. I can get this guy? Was that a Lumis? Let me get more of your fluid. Where's your fluid? Don't you run from me. I'm going to drain you dry. Nice. Give me, give me the juice. Oh, hey, Volbeat's right there. See, I got some fluid. Oh, you remember when these guys got buffed? I think it was in Grand Coliseum. They made them bug electric, which is kind of cool. Why didn't they keep that typing? Well, it was a fan-made typing. I wish it was a real typing. I'm not sure if you'll ever see something that dramatic in a in a uh, vanilla Pokemon game. Though they did, I saw they did change Empoleon's uh, hidden ability to competitive, which is like a huge buff for that Mon. Oh, does Shift Tree have another one as well? What did Shift Tree get? Did they actually make Shift Tree, like, decent? <laughs> oh, it got Wind Rider, just like Bramble Gas. Oh, that's actually interesting. Interesting. Wind Rider, you get a, uh, what is it? You get, like, an attack buff when you get hit. With a wind-based move, I think. So, like, Hurricane, uh, Tailwind. I think Blizzard's another one. It's, uh, it's a pretty good ability. It's, I mean, it's mainly used in VGC, but it could make it pretty good. Hello, love of my life. I have a question for you. Let's hear it. Seven, way to go, champ! 
Look at this guy. Look at that swag walk. CC, thank you for the seven years. Thank you so much. Guys, you like the, uh, that cutscene? It was a doozy. Oh, I'm pogging. This is the Festival of Mass today, just the first day. It'll keep going for a while. What are your thoughts on me booking on the... Wait. What are your thoughts on me booking a private Taylor movie show for my birthday? Oh, yeah, dude. Let's do it. I'll pay for it. Is it just going to be us in the theater? Or are you going to invite people? <laughs> are you going to invite Taylor Swift? Yeah, Tina, that's great. Do it. I'll pay for it. Yeah, dude. Uh, I bet you don't have any festivals as big over in Paldea or wherever, right? That's true. You can invite up to 40 people. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, Kitakami's just as good as any of your big shiny cities. It's okay, Ray. Just ignore her. Oh, I will. I'll snap a photo so you can remember this amazing night forever. Give me your roto stick for a sec. Well, hey, <laughs> I'm married, dude. Relax. Scooch in closer. You're stepping on my toes, sis. Stop complaining. This will only take a second. Say Chansey. Okay, there's no fucking pose? Uh, the Festival of Masks is held so we can all honor the loyal three of the brave heroes of Kitakami. Loyal three of the Pokemon? Yeah, yeah, I got it. Uh huh? Most of the kids in town were masks of the loyal three like me. Did I mention there are heroes? Oh, we got a little Pikachu mask in the back. Hold on. Wait, how are you eating ice cream through the mask? Anyway. What are you laughing at? I was just thinking it was funny that, like, you don't know anything about the ogre. Pepe laughs. She doesn't know. What? I know the legends of Kitakama better than anybody. Pretty gutsy of you to laugh at your big sis. Sorry. The way Dream does. Kiki's still a little baby, so of course he thinks some kind of terrible monster's cool. He likes the ogre more than the loyal three. Hey, you two, I'm gonna be honest. I don't give a fuck. Can I go back and catch Pokemon? Okay. Yeah, enjoy your apples or whatever. Some shaved ice! Let's go! Uh, strawberry, melon, Alola blue, lemon shaved or grape. Got any grapes? Uh, I'll go, I'll go strawberry. Let's fucking look at Orthworm in the corner. <laughs> What else we got going on here? Fried noodles? Free nudes? Catching power, item drop power, humongo power. <laughs> Excuse me, two candied apples, please. You got it, two candied apples coming right up. Uh, here, Ray, you can have one. Thanks. Grandma gave me some pocket money, so it's no big deal. I love candy apples. You don't get to eat them every day, you know? Grandma always just makes us mochi as a snack. There's even a Pokemon in Katakama that looks like a candy apple. Did you know that? Yeah. Darkrai. Hey, let's check that out over there. Oh, well, hey, if you didn't see the fan guy last time, you could see him now. Him and that Dusclops. No, Dust Skull. Ooh. Yeah. Do you guys think maybe the Nintendo Direct tomorrow is just a 40-minute apology for Pokemon Scarlet and Violet? Or do you think they're going to, like, announce games? <laughs> I say that as I trek on playing the game. <laughs> Look at all these people. This is a cool little, like, story beat, by the way. 
Who the fuck brings their Stantler? Hey, man. Step right up for a game of Ogre Austin. You want to have a go? Sure. Hey, you're one of those kids that came all the way from Paldea, right? I can very well take money. You can't take money from a guest? Oh, dude. Yeah, I'll try it, man. You can cheer me off from a... Could you go away? Yeah. I did one just now. It was pretty easy for me, that is. All right, I didn't ask. 6,400 I need. Go get her, Ray. All right. Uh, oh, there it is. Okay. Ogre House is a traditional game that has been played in Missouri since long ago. Gather up lots of berries and bring them to the berry tables to earn yourself a high score. Uh, the playing field is dotted with ogre balloons in four different colors. Pop these balloons, collect the berries inside of them. Okay. Uh, there are also four different colors of berry tables at your home base. Place... Uh, okay. Sure. Uh, by getting closer, pressing A, once you manage to place the target number of berries, you'll win. From time to time, greedy Pokemon, <laughs> greedy, that's cute, may gather around the berry tables, hoping to gobble up all your hard-earned berries. If you let them, uh, oh, I have to hit R, okay. Two, f okay, well, I probably should have looked at that a little closer. Oh, this is, uh... Yeah, dude. This runs like shit, but this is actually kind of a cute minigame. Guys, just close your eyes and listen to the music. It's not as bad. Oh, where's the greedent? Do I, like, actually see it? Oh. Oh. Where, yeah, where is it? Oh, he's over there. He's over there. Okay, I was about to say, I thought I just saw him. I'm just blind. They have to waddle over there. Okay. Lord, he coming. So would it just make more sense to, like, hoard them? So it just doesn't, like, Take them from you? Oh, I don't need that many. Whoops. Uh, where's where's the green and green boys at? Oh, way the fuck over there. So it says hit Y to return the berry tables. So that's just like literally a quick, like a quick warp. Oh, no, you'll, you'll lose the berries. Okay, that makes sense. This is peak performance, isn't it? Oh, I didn't get enough blue. I'm so dumb. Oh, wait, there's like literally one right here. Got it. There's a max total you can carry. Okay, I was about to say. I feel like that's the difficulty, right? Like, maybe it caps out at nine. Yeah, this is like a cute little minigame. I mean, obviously, it's not performing the best, but as far as like a little thing to play, it's, it's not the worst. The music's kind of catchy. Oh, there you go. Okay, so how... Oh, so you can hold 30 berries total. That's how it works. Okay. Math, baby.
Uh... Oh, there he is over there. Oh, yeah, now I have to go, like, all the way back. Oh, oh God, that jump. I see, okay. A greedy greed it. No! It's so fucking bad. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ. Wait, how close do you need to get? Oh, I see, I see. You gotta get real fucking close. Hey. Okay. Oh, but now I need the black ones. No! I guess I could always grab more on the way back, right? Fuck off. Cool. Well, that... was... okay. Oh, where'd Munchlax come from? Oh, I didn't break a record. Oh, what is this mochi? to see what that is. Is it like an ivy thing? Yeah. I'll take a look in a second. I assume it's an ivy or an eevee thing. That was some fine dashing. Got the XP charm. Having one of these charms increases the XP points your Pokemon get. It's a strange stretchy charm that encourages growth. Oh. Interesting. I, Carmine, Missouri's reigning champion of Ogre Balloon Bust, and have triumphed. I really want to have another go to deliver a crushing final defeat with a killer score, but I don't have much pocket money left. Also, if you were here yesterday and saw Ray's glow-in-the-dark shirt, please see this. <laughs> oh, chat, Tita was so mad. <laughs> Tita was like, what the fuck? Why do you hate the store? Uh, she made a good point. That's the picture I was talking about last uh, yesterday, by the way. Um, it's the the way the lights are set because they're set for my they're set very specifically for my my skin, so it fucks up other things as well. But it does glow. <laughs> I should link that tweet in the. Uh... Actually, let me write that down. I'll I'll link that tweet in the description of the video from yesterday. <laughs> Yeah, and the camera... I don't have the camera to auto-adjust. Yeah, I'll go wander around, whatever you guys fight. Yeah, the TikTok you made was funny. Glasses, can you uh, take that tweet and pin it on the TikTok? I don't know if you can pin comments on TikTok. Be like, hey, the shirt actually does glow in the dark. Ray's just a moron. What are you slurping? Oh, it's a candy apple. Okay. Shrek, where are you going? Shrek. That fan guy's new windmill, by the way. Oh, okay, I guess I literally just have to check out the festival more. Sorry, I have to walk at an angle because, like, I can't run when I walk forward. So if I miss them, uh, my bad. I have to walk at, like, a diagonal. Oh, hey, what's this guy doing over here? Oh, hi, Pikachu. Can I keep a secret? Sure. There's a selfie post for when you... Oh. Shh. It's a secret. Is there anything back over here? So I guess all these like random poses are just like 
hidden in the game. Yep, this is another post. The please emote. Oh, okay. Weaponized cuteness. Hey, Shrek. That just looks like a girl wearing a big hoodie. Hey, man. It's a cool mask you got there. Mysterious child is staring at you from behind their mask. Are you enjoying the festival? Would you say it's the bestival? Hey, Ray, listen to this. It's nuts. Kiki's no use at all. Zero talent for ousting ogres, I'm telling you. Oh, you, you fucking scared it. Who was that? I don't know. We didn't get that far. It's the Duolingo Owl. Oh, cutscene. Shit. Oh no! Oh, it looks cute. Wow, dude, anti-mask, huh? All right, dude. I see you. Pokemon getting political. Yikes. Yikes. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> Is that dream? <laughs> That's the name of the DLC! A teal mask pattern uh, after the face of an ogre. Ogre Pond dropped it while fleeing up the stairs after visiting the Festival of Masks. Who was that? Where'd that kid come from? Was it a Pokemon? What are you talking about? Wait, do you mean the kid we just saw that ran off toward the mountain? Could that have been the ogre from the story of on all the signboards? Are you saying the story was true? I mean, they did drop a mask, so they really must be. Oh shit, right, this kid. What are you guys doing over here? Uh, there was an ogre here. <laughs> Wait, stop, stop! Why are you yelling all of a sudden, sis? It's nothing, it's nothing you'd be interested in at all, I swear. Huh? Okay, I get it. I bet you were making fun of me behind my back. Jesus. You guys have a healthy relationship. I love it. Whew. At least he didn't figure out what we were really talking about. Don't scare me like that blabbing uh, for the whole world to hear. Don't you have any filter? Kiki really likes the ogre. Like, really, really, really likes... What? Was he gonna fuck the ogre? What are you saying? Why did you say really so many times? If he found out we'd seen the ogre without him, I guess I was afraid he'd feel bad. Feel, like, left out or something. Am I overthinking it? I didn't want him running up the mountain to follow the ogre this hour either. I'd go with him. I'd protect him. Let's keep this whole thing our little secret. Sure. Also, don't show him the mask. The mask is ginormous. Where am I going to put this thing? God, I want to ride Karidon right now. In a not sexy way. I just want to go fast. Hide it in plain sight. <laughs> Just wear the mask, but never address it. Hydro, thank you for the six months. Gamer Jake, Panda. Thank you, gamers. Thank you. Hope you're having a good, uh, what fucking day is it? Wednesday? It is Wednesday, my dude. Uh, reminder, I usually take off Thursdays, but I am streaming tomorrow. I'm streaming every day this week. The next day off is on Monday. Tomorrow we will be playing more of this, hopefully finishing up the DLC, getting all the Pokemon and all that. But we also have the um, the the Nintendo Direct and the Sony State of Play tomorrow. It's going to be a busy day. What's up, bacon? 
Oh, look at Clefable. Two illegal streams in one week, I know, dude. Is that legal? Why are those two Vulpix on the roof? There you are, Ray. Just because we didn't agree to meet doesn't mean you get to keep me waiting. I want to talk to you a bit. No, I haven't told anybody about anything. You better not be lying if I found out you blabble. I'm going to make you swallow a coughing hole. You saw the thing we picked up at the stairs, right? My grandpa knows a lot uh, about the village history. We should go talk to him about it. Sure. Yeah, I know where your house is. Mm-hmm. What a bizarre threat. Yeah, no kidding. Hey, this ball of toxic fumes, I'm going to make it make you eat it against your will. Whoa, dude, relax. Hello, Ray. Good morning. He's awake, huh? Want to go see the last signboard? Go find someplace else to be. Ray's got business with me. <laughs> His face. Oh. She's spending all her time with you. That's so unfair. You could be such a jerk. What'd you just call me? What's his deal? Kiki should know better than to talk back to me like that. That's enough, Carmine. Be kind to your younger brother. Brother. I was being kind. It's not like I hit him or anything. Can we talk about this map so I go back to the game? Or this mask, not this map. Could this be an empty hand? This mask belongs to that poor ogre. Where'd you find it? We bumped into it. The ogre, I mean, yesterday at the Festival of Masks. I tried talking to all... She tried talking to all nice. Yeah, whatever. Hey, thank you for the store order. Frameratemerch.com. What do you mean, still, I thought the ogre was a scoundrel that attacked the village? I suppose it's time I told you, Carmine. Yeah. You see, the truth of what happened with that ogre is the other way around. <gasps> the three guys were the bad guys. You should hear this too, Ray. Yeah, I, I mean, I can't move, so I'm kind of stuck here. Yeah, let's hear the true story. Oh. Yeah. All right, deep lore chat. You guys ready for a Yakuza length cutscene? Yeah, chat, there's going to be a test at the end of this, so write this all down, all right? A long, long time ago, a man and an ogre came to Kitakami from a foreign land. The people of the village feared the man and the ogre who looked so different from them. Oh, this is has racial undertones. Uh-oh. And so they refused to let the travelers come anywhere near the village. That does look like Reggie Rock in a suit. <laughs> That's why they were afraid. He walked up with, oon, oon, oon. The men and the ogre were saddened that the villagers did not welcome them. But they were happy just to have each other. They settled quietly in a cave on the mountain. They quickly settled in a van down by the river. There was only one villager who pitied the two travelers, the village mask maker. He made several masks for the man and the ogre. The masks were brilliant works adorned with gems the man brought from somewhere far away. Like Yanova or Johto? By wearing these masks, the travelers could hide their true faces and mingle with the villagers. Okay, but surely they wouldn't be dumb enough to not know it's the same guy but with a mask, right? The man and the ogre were overjoyed. They thanked the mask maker for his kindness. 
Wearing the mask, the man the ogre started secretly joining the, vi the village festival. The mysterious pair soon became the talk of the village because of their brilliant masks. In fact, rumors about them quickly spread far and wide, even to distant lands. But rumors of exquisite shining masks attract more than just innocent curiosity. Uh-oh. Sorry, taking a sip. A group of greedy Pokemon soon made their way to the land of Kitakami. These Pokemon sneaked into the cave in which the man and the ogre lived. And tried to make off with the masks which were carefully stored away. Is yeah, isn't it snuck? Sneaked? Snuck? I don't know. The man happened to be there. He managed to hold on to one of the masks. But he was not strong enough to protect them all. The Pokemon stole the other three masks. He didn't have, like, a gun? Several hours later, when the ogre returned to the cave, it found its beloved home in ruin. All that was left were the signs of a struggle and a teal mask. Oh, Jesus! The ogre donned that mask and went down to the village, perhaps to search for its friend. Where do you get this, like... I think it's supposed to be a spiked club or a spiked bat, but it kind of looks like a shish kebab to me. Like, he just grilled it, and he's like, this is the only thing I have for a weapon. It found the greedy Pokemon there gloating over their stolen masks and defeated them. The villagers, of course, had no idea what was happening, nor why. They were confused that the kebab he was wielding. All they saw was a raging ogre, and they felt great fear. The villagers thought the three Pokemon had fallen trying to protect the village from the ogre. To honor their sacrifice, the villagers named them the Loyal Three, and it... Oh, dude, he fucking killed them! Jeez! Let's go! Wounded and weak, the ogre returned to its cave alone with a great sadness. What happened to the other guy? They just took the mask. Did they kill him? What? Yo, everyone in this village is racist and dumb. That's terrible. Ogre Pond didn't deserve that, and the Loyal Three, they're the worst. Well, they're dead now, so, allegedly. The story everyone's been told is the complete opposite of the truth. They gotta hear about this. Calm yourself, Carmine. I told you are ready to keep it to yourself. But, Grandpa! Yeah, dude. Alright, Steve, I'll relax. The villagers believe their own version of history. They revere the Loyal Three. Oh, I guess I put my face cam back up. So how would they react to being told that they've got it all wrong? They'll probably get angry? I'm about to bust. Exactly. Store order. Framerate.merch.com. Thank you so much. Back when this all occurred, the mask maker, that is to say our ancestor, tried desperately to tell the truth of the matter. But no one would take him seriously. In fact, it said he was persecuted as a heretic. Holy shit. That really gets my blood boiling. In the end, the mask maker chose to protect his descendants, us, by keeping his mouth shut. However, he kept the truth alive, passed down from generation to generation as a family secret. I see. Kiki doesn't know the whole story yet, does he? Well, no, because you made him go away. I don't know, he just really seems to like the ogre. He's practically obsessed, and he's been trying to one-up me as if he knows more about Ogre Pond than I do. Well, I can't say what's going on with the boy, but he always was a sensitive child. It wouldn't surprise me if it's somehow in, uh, into, in, oh, fucking, that word's gone. I don't even know how to say that word. Intuished? He's intuitive. He figured it out on his own. You'll tell Kiki when the time is right, sure. Mm-hmm. Now I really can't tell Kiki we met the ogre. Yeah, fucking up. I mean, I can. About the mask you showed me, I noticed the jewel on its forehead was chipped. I might be able to fix it. Would you mind leaving the mask with me for a little while? Maybe it got chipped when it fell down the stairs. Oh, uh, ma yeah, maybe. It's his grandpa's offering. Let's get it all nice and fixed up before we give it back to Ogre Pond. Am I going to be able to catch this Pokemon? I assume so, right? So this whole story about Ogre Pond is, is great and all, and then I'm going to enslave it in a Pokeball? Nice. What happened to the rest of our class? Oh, uh, they're dead. That is going through the wall. Oh, he heard everything. Oh, shit.
Our class got like mauled to death by my Diana. It's fine. I want to see Ogre Pond again, but getting its mass fixed will have to come first. For now, we should carry on with Ori. Yep, sure. Thank you for the store order. All right. Where is he at? I can play the game again. Let's go. Oh, he's like literally right here. Um, okay. I'm gonna, yes, I'm going to fast travel here because I'm that lazy. We're helping. Hey, man. Hey, Ray. So I was going to ask, what were you and my sis talking about? This and that, I guess. Nice and vague. I see. So about those signs, the last one's a bit of a hike away. Paradise Barrens on the other side of Oni Mountain. Uh, okay. I forgot we're still doing this sign quest. Hey, I miss Penny. Can Penny come back? She was great. What was the name of the guy with the big dog? Arvin or some shit? He was cool too. Hmm. Have I been over here? I'm not sure if I've been over there yet. Hmm, okay. We gotta go way the fuck over here, huh? Alright, let me mark it on the map. And, uh... Alright, let's just get... Let's just get going. Oh, I should probably actually fast travel to somewhere faster. By the way, I think these are like our classmates right here. You know, that girl and that kid. Give us Larry. Yeah, I don't think Larry's in this DLC, unfortunately. Where's my man, Clive? The Crystal Pool. Alright, we'll just uh, go this way and fly down. Yeet! Any Pokemon over here? Oh, probably the same like Slugmas and whatnot, right? Slugma, Geodudes. Okay. I somehow missed that Pokeball. Let's go. Spoink! Spoink, don't stop. Don't stop jumping. Look at him go! Spoink, apparently you were in the fucking main game. Oh, Geo, dude, please. I hope he, dude, I hope he never stops bouncing. Shout out to Grumpig, a Pokemon that I think looks kind of cool, but is has like not correct typing and uh, it's just not good. <laughs> ah, Vikavolt. Poison Vikavolt. Um, I guess I could try using this to get the Vikavolt. I guess you could also just evolve the Charger Bug. Eh. Let's get this while I'm here. Uh, Ghosty? Probably next Sunday is what I'm thinking for the next um, WWE 2K23 stream. Oh, don't have... Geez, fuck, that's double edge. That's annoying. Shout out to Vikavolt having... Oops. There you go. Having a Pokedex entry saying that it's fast as fuck with like 40 base speed. Yeah. They really nailed the description on that one.
Nice. It uses the sucker on its head to hang from a tree or from yeah, eaves. Dude. It can produce seven different tones. Cool. Pop. Scotland, thank you for the 101 months bearded demon. Thank you for the 57. Anything special over here? Um, anything? Oh, there's Scald. Scald is back. Oh, there's Lampent. I'm sure there's going to be some OP Pokemon that were already OP that get uh, Scald that get even better. Oh, let me clear, uh, I'll clear my box here of the... Of what's his face? Uh, is it over here? It is. Chingling, I don't need you anymore. So, and pull down with scald and competitive. That's why I said the most exciting thing about this is seeing like, like the most exciting thing about this DLC is seeing the meta shifts. As someone that consumes a lot of competitive Pokemon content. Ah, uh, now this is gaming. Uh, I'm trying to see if there's anything special down here. Low battery. You know, I guess I haven't charged this thing in a while. Oh, what's in here? Break, break. That tasty popping. <laughs> it's just part of the gaming experience. Anything down here? And more rocks. Framerate.merch.com. Thank you for the store order. Thank you kindly. Look at this nice open field. <laughs> or not even field, but open. Oh, fucking stop yelling at me. All right, hold on. Let me get the cable. Hold on. Yeah. Oh wait, I'm fucking stupid. Hey mister, you wanna wrestle? Alright, we should be Gucci. Um... Well, it says 100%, even though it's... Whatever. It's next! Chadley, thank you for the 35 months. Oh, that's the console's 100%, okay. Makes sense, this thing has been docked for like four years. The magnet nose passes nose provides an un unearing compass? Man, I wish I learned how to read. Uh, unearing compass making the Pokemon an excellent partner for trainers to go on a journey. Pop. All right, um, well there's the sign. What are we fighting here? Oh, makes sense. Oh, we caught one of those already in a raid. Mudbray we already got. Anything else over here? Yeah, dude. Oh, Sand Shrew! Vincent, thank you for the eight months. Sand Shrew, what a cute, adorable little Pokemon. Hamter's back. Hamter. It digs deep burrows to live in. When in danger, it rolls up its body to withstand attacks. 
Same. I just go into the fetal position and let it happen. They beat the shit out of me until they get bored. There's Gligar again. Um, Houndour. Bonsley. Shinx. What's this over here? Oh, that's an Earthworm. Okay. It's like, what's that red thing? Um, got all these guys. I guess there's a Graveler I can grab. Uh, yeah, we'll 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 get this Graveler. Pseudo Wudo. Hope, thank you for the 88. Nice. All right, I'll have to trade that. Trade that with glasses later, I guess. Are there any other trade evolutions in this DLC? Oh, wait, Gligar is a fucking trade evolution. Never mind. A slow walker, it rolls to move. It pays no attention to any object that happens to be in its path. Girder. Oh, Politoed. Oh, is Girder a trade evolution? Never knew that. Me and Glasses will be trading a lot later. Um, any other crazy Pokemon over here? Doesn't look like it. Ooh, Wild Charge. Oh, Sand Slash. Alright, well that's easy. Hey, buddy. You son of a bitch! Do 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 do. All right, well that's not gonna do anything to either of us. So that was a waste. Ooh, we got the flinch. No crit, no crit. Nice. Uh, for the aesthetics. Getting the flask. Damn it. Try one more. If not, I'll switch to Breloom. Nice. Alright. He was a little annoying, but not like, yeah, not like Yanma. <laughs> Alright. Nice. It is adept at attacking with the spines on its back and its sharp claws uh, while quickly scurrying about. Hell yeah, Sand Slash. All right, we can release the, uh, the Sand Shrew. Be free, little buddy. Release the Geodude as well. Enjoy life. Whoops. Uh, anything else over here? There's a cave over there. Bonsley. All right. Mouse hold. Tandem mouse, whatever. Dude, they could be shiny, but you can't really tell unless you look at their shirt. Oh my god, please. Oh, this camera angle. Nice. Sorry for the concussion. Gra grab the ball. Thank you. Alright, let's go take a picture of that sign. Ooh, 
which is... Is it further up? Oh, it's this way. Okay. Oh, I can just fly there. Perfect. Shiz, what's going on? Thank you for the 97. 97 months. These are the Paradise Barrens. Pretty lonely place, huh? According to the old legends, the ogre used to be seen here. Uh, see around here lots. Do you want... Okay. Sure, dude. Let's battle. Why not? Got a shiny Sawaddle. Nice. Do we still have that prediction if I'm going to get a shiny in this? Because I'm like kind of paying attention to a Pokemon or shiny. We do. Okay. You want to win? Bro, I got some bad news for you. Penguin, thank you for the 20. Neo, thank you for the 34. Pokemon Lumi Plat and Pokemon Scarlet. Yeah. It's hard to go from Luminescent Platinum to this. We need a uh, Pokemon Luminescent Violet. What's between Scarlet and Violet? Just make a Lum uh, Pokemon Luminescent Gun. Uh, you're going to punch me real hard. Valooza, because someone has to use it. Oh, wow. All right. A special polyrath? What? I guess he doesn't have a fighting move. Oh, Dripplin! Comes out in that jacket. Uh, oh, you're still... Was it Grass Dragon, right? So... See ya. Okay, so when it comes in, it lowers your evasiveness, and then I forgot what its signature move does. It, like, lowers speed or something for, like, three turns, right? I think. Oh, don't cover me in syrup! Yeah, no! Yes, yeah, syrup bomb. And then it lowers my speed for, like, three turns, I think. Yeah. Cool. Uh, I'm playing Scarlet. Neo, thank you for the 69. Kane, thank you for the 42. We don't miss play rough here. Ferret, okay. I guess that's your ace. Oh, I did see that. When uh, the, the syrup bomb move changes if uh, he's shiny. Which is a really, really cool uh, effect. I think that's the only move that gets changed when a Pokemon is shiny. Ooh, nice crit. Uh, lock? Thank you for the 40. Oh, does Blacephalon's move too? Mind blown. I know that. I've only seen competitive Blacephalon in showdown <laughs> or see Bl Blacephalon used in combat in um, showdown I lost it's because I'm weak that's why dude the Arthur meme oh my god would you go check out the sign come on let's get this over with If you see a shadowy figure approaching you outside the village at twilight, be wary. That's just good life advice. Don a mask at once and hide your face. 
Do so, and whether the shadow is man or monster, you will pass each other by as fellow mask wearers. <laughs> if you should meet the shadow when you have no mask in hand, then pray that it is only a man. If it is, you will live to see another day, and you will remember to never forget your mask again. But if it's an ogre, you will meet your end, as do all humans whose faces are seen by it. Once it sees your face, your soul will be forfeit, and you shall never return to the village. Oh my god. You will fucking die. In the old days, everyone carried masks wherever they went, and the one who made those masks was actually my great-great-great-grandpa. Grandpa's great-great-great-grandpa or something. That's amazing. I mean, I don't think any of that stuff about the ogre stealing souls is true or anything, but it is true that our family used to make masks. Our family has a long line of mask makers. Even my grams can make them. I even heard that the reason we hold the Festival of Masks is because our ancestors came up with the idea. But I don't really like what they wrote on the sign here. Just because the ogre seems sort of scary, everyone got all afraid of it and drove it away from the village. But I'm pretty sure the ogre must have been lonely on its own. Left all alone like that, treated like some kind of outcast. All right, all right, all right, all right. All... You think so too, huh, Ray? Wait, did the time of day just change? Want to take the last photo? Sure. This kid's going to kill me in my sleep. Well, we're all done with our assignment now, but I've got to get stronger with my Pokemon. I'm going to head home. All right, see you. Poseidon, thank you for the 42. All right. Oh, shit. I got stuck on the rock. Uh, I guess we could fast travel back. What's up, Adam? How's the DLC? Eh, it's fine. It's exactly what you think a Pokemon Scarlet DLC would be. It's been fun seeing some returning Pokemon. Some of the new Pokemon I've seen so far have been pretty cool, but it's kind of, you know, what you expect. Very, very political, though. It's, it's, uh, this, this DLC is pretty woke. dude. That's kind of a shock. Nah, two cannons in the next DLC. Saving the best for last, exactly. No. Oh, that's for the menus, okay. No, no, they're good, they're good. Who's this guy? Hey, man. Oh, he's telling me about the festival. Uh, anyone else over here? No. Beep, beep. Um, yeah, I'm calling it a night. It's like 3 p.m. The next day. Oh, hey, my. Good morning, Ray. Don't talk to me, you freak. Carmine wanted me to tell you that she's waiting at her place. She said you better get a move on and don't keep me waiting. All right. Uh, camera. Thank you. Make pasta sauce, thank you for the 31 months. Am I streaming the Nintendo Direct tomorrow? I am. The Nintendo Direct and the Sony State of Play. And hopefully finishing up this DLC as well. Okay. Please, Dad. Thanks. Ray, you took your sweet time. We wanted to talk to you before Kiki wakes up. I wanted to fix Deer Ogrepan's mask, but I'll need one more material if I want to do a proper job of it. According to Grandpa, we need to get a crystal cluster from the bottom of the crystal pool. I mean, we could just return the mask as is, but I think it would make Ogrepan really happy if we fixed it up first. Sure. 
Especially now that I've heard the real story. I just want Ogre Pond to be happy, you know? I'm sure Ogre Pond will be pleased to know you care so much for it. Right? Good morning, Grandpa. Yeah, dude. Good morning, Kieran. Kiki, you better go kill time somewhere. Yeah, yeah, do whatever you want, sis. Bro, I don't care about these kids. Let me just go do the thing. Teen angst. Yeah, both of you have teen angst. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll go get the jewel or whatever. Or the cluster for the jewel. Okay. That is up here. Perfect. Exploring paid off. Oh, do I have to like look at the laggy water again? Because that's not going to be great. Is that a Yanma? Okay, I guess Yanma is bigger. Hey. Oh boy. Get a load of this view. I, you know what? I don't want to. It's not really the view you think it is. <laughs> Why would they put this scene in this, knowing it looks like shit? This is the crystal pool. Bet you didn't expect it to be so pretty, huh? Nope, sure didn't. The crystals here are always shining. Isn't that strange? There's even a weird rumor that you can meet people who have passed away. Now we'll need to get a little bit of the crystal in the bottom of the pool so we can fix the mass properly. And that's where you come in, Ray. Go on then. Jump in. Don't be scared. Wait, you want me to jump in? Ah, uh, yeah. I can't swim besides my clothes will get soaked. Uh, you got a nifty Pokemon to ride on, right? You'll be fine. Rumble, rumble. An earthquake? Oh, melodic! Me lo 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 lo! You know, that's what melodic sounds like. You guys ever seen the anime? Just like that. This one looks strong. You're awful lucky that I'm around. I get, you know what? To be fair, you do have an electric Pokemon, so. Oh, le shit, level 73, huh? I could actually shed tail here. I just leave. Fuck you, more more Pico. Uh. Do! Please don't have Ice Beam, actually. Oh, Tina sent me a text. Hold on. Okay, well, fuck. I guess I didn't need to do all that. I guess I could have just attacked it. Let's finish this? Yeah, I thought this thing was going to be stronger. Oh, I'm like way over there. Yeah, Tropius, get the final blow. It's so slow. I didn't do anything in that fight. Okay. Well, um, thanks. Way to go, Tropius. Way to go. Yeah, I didn't even need to do anything. Okay. Anyway, so that was melodic. Oh my god, is that the cluster so conveniently left there? Oh my god. Yeah, I took half damage for no reason. That's <laughs> that's exactly what I did. I punched myself in the nuts. That's what I did that fight. Maybe it was stuck to the Pokemon you fought. The energy coming from those crystals at the bottom of the pool. I knew it. Miss Briar. More like Miss Step on me. I thought you were paired with other students. You decided to switch things up? I'm sorry, Miss Briar, but this place is actually pretty special. I'm not a big fan of outsiders just wandering around up here. I'm aware that this is sacred ground. Yes, I was. I did get permission from the caretaker, though. Was that not sufficient? Why'd you come here? Just doing a bit of field research. I was interested in the properties of the water here. Dude, is she some kind of villain? Oh, my God. Stop showing the goddamn crystal pool. 
Yes, terrestria, terrestrialization, whatever. See ya. Go back to Carmine's house. You couldn't just take me with her? Alright. God damn. The music here kind of reminds me of Area Zero, which is kind of nice. Uh, did I check what this was? Oh, right, right. That was the, uh, that was that guy. Yeah, that's the Glamora thing. Um. Doom, doom. Oh, shit. It's the Nutsack. I'm good, thanks. Feeboss isn't too hard to find. Oh, that's good. Ooh, power gem. Um, fucking Taco Bell. I don't know why I'm walking. I could just fucking teleport. Oh, here we go. There's just shit to collect, even though I know I'm never going to use it. I'm just like... I want to keep grabbing it because I have a problem. Um... Alright. The masculine urge to hit A and acquire items, exactly. Just like in platformers, or like Mario, for example, where you collect coins and you're like, I don't need this, but I can't, like, not grab it. Oops, sorry. Oh, the two hoo-hooed up there. We got the cluster. You're so sorry. Did you lose the mask? Oh no, the kid ran off with the mask. Why'd he do that? I haven't said a word about the ogre. Remember, I tried to do it and you like punched me in the throat? Loyalty Plaza. Okay. The kid is evil. That was... Was that the one over here? No, that's... Over here. Hey, man. Can I have the mask back? Ray. Kiki, what in the world do you think you're doing? You two knew, didn't you? Knew that the ogre wasn't the real bad guy in the stories? The loyal three were the real bad guys, but the ogre... Ogre's the one that gets treated like an outcast. You knew? And you two did the same thing to me. You treated me like an outcast when you went and met with the ogre. I mean... We didn't really meet up with the ogre. We ran into the ogre. You know, different than those villagers back then. You know how much I love the ogre. What is happening? <laughs> Behind my back all along. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's gotten into you, Kiki? You're acting real off today. Oh, I thought he was going to actually fix his bangs. I got excited for a second. We... Yeah. Sure. Okay. This kid wrote Shrek is love, Shrek is love. Oh, he's not going to hold back. All right. This kid actually just has a fear rattata and I lose. Holy shit, he evolved as Yanma. This is going to hurt a lot.
He fell straight down. Is that lower speed? No. Ah, uh, he's got another one coming in. Let's do... I guess we'd sack Earthworm here. Actually, no. We'll leave him in. We'll leave him in. Uh, we'll go take a ton. Why not? Thank you, Jono, for the 79. Oh, interesting. Went Air Slash. Surprised this thing doesn't have a uh, speed boost. Oh, the flinch! Oh, the flinch again! This will throw him off. Yeah, flinch me three times, pussy. Does it have tint and lens instead? Maybe. Hey, finally. <laughs> Yeah, so like none of these Pokemon I have, besides the Skeledurge, are like Eevee trained or whatever. These are just like some of the team I used beforehand. Or went in the main playthrough. Oh, this isn't evolved. Wow, have no friends to evolve this, huh? Fucking loser. Alright, he'll kill me here. Ooh, I should have probably switched there. Because I could have gone back to Earth Earthworm and healed. It's time, everyone's favorite, Volusa. I'm breaking the mold. Yeah, Tinkaton has no attack. That's how it's balanced. It's the best type in the game. It has a what looks like an overpowered move, but yeah, it has like no attack. Me never knowing what breaking the mold does. Uh, mold breaker just, uh, or when you break the mold, you just ignore abilities. So, like, if you have mold breaker and a Pokemon had levitate, you could hit him with a ground move. I am a confusion. Ah. How are you going, Mr. Mime? Why can't it? Why doesn't it just say that? Oh, the mold breaker thing? Fucking up. Cheeto bird! Um, we're gonna hit another one, no fear. Let's go! Cheeto, another confusion! Let's go, Dole! Uh, Leaf Storm all in. You fucking idiot! No, I'm gonna miss. Just kidding. Do. Polyrath, huh? Uh, I'll switch out here. We'll switch out, let this die, and then we'll get, like, Veluza in. Thank you. Also, if I want to use Dole again. Actually, I'll use Dole again. I'll, I reset my, uh, my special attack.
Oh, here we go. Terra Hurricane. This is going to be sick, or I'm just going to die. <laughs> I hate whenever you use Dragon Pulse, you can see the weird graphical cut in between the beams. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Come on, Tropius. That does nothing. We have a free hit. Let's go! Hell yeah. Nice. Way to go, Dole. Why can't I be as good as you? Ooh, 4,200, huh? I could have made, if I could have had nine more dollars. Could have been kind of close to 40, uh, 420, 60, 69. Oh, man. Ah. Can I have the mask now? A Blu-ray copy of the... Owie, my hand. Kiki, you all right? Here I promised. Thanks. Say hi to the ogre for me. All right. Weird champ. I'm sorry about all that. He's normally not like this at all. It's kind of scary. He punched the, the stone. Did you hear something? The Lonely Three Monument. Oh, no. What do you think is going to spawn? I think it's going to be Uxie, Mess Spirit, and Azelf. Oh, there they go. He punched it so hard he spawned them. Tag yourself. I'm the dumb idiot on the left. I'm the dirt fair. Yeah, why the bird looking kind of sexy? Oh, is my mic on? Whoops. What in the world? Griffic. Okay. Oh, Mr. Mackey. Hello. Yip, yip, ippy. What do you want? Oh my god, look at that bushy tail. See ya. Seriously, what's going on? What was that all about? It's the Loyal Three. Hey, you're right. There were three of them, and they looked all sinister. That's got to be them. The story said they were laid to rest under the statues, right? What brought them back to life? Wait, they ran off toward Kitakama Hall. Dude, people are going to be really fucking excited. Off they go in 5 FPS. Nice and slow. Oh, you can teleport just straight to the sign. Sick. The punch heard around the world. <laughs> oh, okay. For some reason, I thought I'd go further. Hey, man. Do you see a big ape monk or was it bear monkey bird those lousy three Pokemon come here I believe you mean the loyal three Carmine forget about that silly title always with your attitude but yes you did miss out on an incredible treat the loyal three were just visiting our humble little hall it seemed they wished to collect the shining mask we've kept safe here 
at Kitakami Hall. So naturally, we representatives of the hall were happy to return the masks to them with all haste. You gave them the masks? And we offered them a platter of our special Kitakami mochi, packed with full of our best herbs. The loyal three gobbled them up in a flash. Gobble me, swallow me. They're bigger and stronger now. Great. Uh, but those lousy three of the bad guys, the masks belong to Ogre Pond. Really wish I could tell them everything. Where'd they go? They went at once to ascend Oni Mountain. Perhaps they have in mind to finish off the terrible ogre that lurks in the dreaded den. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Dude, they're stronger and fed. They're going to go destroy the ogre. Let's go help. Hey, actually give your, like, grandpa this mask or whatever, all right? Don't, like, I don't know. Give it to, what's his name, Kiki? The bear, the bear is going to eat him. Oh, my Pokemon are still, like, in shambles. Whoops. All right, I could just, like, fast travel there, right? Sure can't. Okay. Um, let me heal first. <laughs> He's got to grab the spiky stick. He's got to grab his kebab. His, his weapon of choice. Sean, thank you for the 71, by the way. Jaws, Jono, appreciate it, gamers. This is a great angle. Um, okay, thanks. She has pretty eyes. Oh, yeah, that, like, purple. Oh, hey. The upside-down peace emote. Oh, thanks. I'm, I'm, yep, I'm good. I forgot you need to charge your Terra Orb. Uh, we'll go this way and just jump down. Yeah, it's kind of wild how all, almost all the Pokemon games, their story is like, oh, hey, the world's going to explode. You're 10 years old. Fix this. What? What? I'm on my way! I'm here! Pop. Oh, hey guys. bullied what's up you fucking jabronis yeah yip yip eat yourself I hate how his scarf is just always up why is that bear's scarf erect hey man Alright, I guess I can't catch you. I don't even know what type you are. Uh... Iron Head, I guess. Alright, well that was neutral. Oh yeah, so I like definitely can't catch these, right? I don't want to like miss these. Yeah, it's not even an option. Okay. Uh, I guess I'll just Iron Head again. You fucking idiot! I'm Steel type, you nerd! Alright. Nice. Okay. Well, that was easy. We beat up Mr. Mackey. Oh, hey, look who's all here. 
Uh, not gonna follow you. They're trying to go three against one on you. I guess a fair fight. Too much to expect, but now that we're here. We'll make you regret ever coming back to life. Does he have a heart on his ass? Was that what that was? All right, see ya. Ray, I, uh... Go on, say it properly. About the mask, I just got so angry. What I did was real dumb. So I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm not accepting your apology unless you gift 100 subs at twitch.tv slash Ray. Then you're good. If not, you're dead to me. He was sulking around here, so I grabbed him by the collar and dragged him here. Glad I did. Oh, yeah, hey, we have your mask. Hey, buddy. The real life ogre. Wowzers, you're really something. You want to be the one to give the mask back to Ogre Pond, right, Kiki? This is for you, dear ogre. God forbid they actually put it in his hand. But it seems scared. Maybe it's not good with new people. I don't think it'll take the mask if I'm the one giving it back. You should be the one to do it, right? Well, I did just save it, so I agree. It's so excited. It seems so happy. It seems pretty comfortable around you, right? Be nice if we can give the other three masks back to Ogre Pond too, don't you think? Uh, did those three Pokemon take the masks that were in Kitakami Hall? Never mind, the masks rightfully belong to poor Ogre Pond here. I wouldn't put it past the so-called loyal three to plot a second ambush either. We need to keep Ogre Pond safe while we deal with them. The three of us are gonna form a, a the mask retrieval squad. Hell yeah, the MRS. Sure. I get to be the second in command. Oh, great. Yeah, Carmen, I guess... Or I'm sorry, Kiki, you can come too. Could have been the IRS. That's, that's scarier. Oh. That's cool. So what if I do this? Can I just, like, outrun it? Okay, yep, it's gone. I'm sure I'll just show up behind me. I never did take this narrow path, so I'm gonna see if there's anything interesting here. Uh, Salandit. Geodude. Noibat. Uh, what is that? Oh! Hatena. One of those might have been shiny. I don't know. I feel like the hat tennis shiny is pretty similar. Anything? Pichu. Growlithe. It just fucking appears. Okay. What's in here? Ah, oh, it. Yeah, we got a it already. All right, we'll just warp. Uh, right over here. Perfect. All right, as soon as we load in, I'm going to uh, run to the bathroom, be a little piss boy, and then I'll be back and we'll keep playing. Uh, I guess after this cutscene. What's wrong, Ogre Pond? I bet it doesn't want to go into the village. The villagers did a pretty good job of chasing it away back then, so yeah, you're right. Okay, well, maybe Ogre Pond can wait for us here. We'll go gather information while it waits. Do you think it'll be okay? Pay attention now, Ogre Pond. We go in the village, you stay here. Ogre Pond, stay. Do you understand? I'm going to take that as a no. Be good and stay out of trouble. Okay, well, it's not even looking. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I'm talking to its back. What's wrong with what I said? You're not very likable. Simple Jeff, thank you for the 43. 
Alright. I know it's auto-saving, but let me just quickly save myself. And I'm gonna run to the bathroom. I will be right back, chat. BRB. Feels good to sit down, gamers. Oh, hell yeah. Oops. Welcome back, old stinky streamer. You right. Oh, should I talk? Oh my god, Jesus Christ, the lag. Am I just talking to everybody? Do you guys see the loyal three? Kitakama Hall, okay. How about you? This guy's just like... Just like looking at a... Bush? Anybody? Loyal three? Hey, man. Oh, Mr. Billy and Lady O'Nair. What is this? Lady O'Nair said something about a place with a view of the bountiful fields of the countryside. But where is that? Oh, I don't know. I'm looking for a, a gorilla. Monkey Dory taking a nap. It'd be so peaceful around the pond. What a pl ideal place for a snoo. Ooh, I got a clue. Okay, so I guess I'm just looking for orange. Uh... Oh, what is this? Oh, oh, she's cute. Hey. Hey. Yeah, have you seen like a bird or something? What am I looking for? It's a small town, you know. News tends to spread pretty quickly. Perrin, by the way. I'm a traveler with a bit of a thing for photography. Yeah, dude. Ha Steve, we're last. Have you covered wars? This here's my buddy. Growlithe, doesn't the little horn on his head make it the cutest? Kinda, yeah. You wanna take my photo? Sure, man. Just like that, huh? Are you always always this open with total strangers? I've got a unique vibe. Oh, dude. Do you see my uh do you see me from across the bar? Do you like my vibe? Gonna make be making this town my home base for a little while. Won't you focus on wrapping up whatever you got going on? Come see me after. Oh, okay, sure. She kind of looks like the dude from PLA. Is that supposed to be like his ancestor? That would make sense because there's a Hisuian Pokemon here. What was his name? Fucking Affleck or whatever. Adaman. All oh, right, yeah. Not Adam wo woman. Adaman. Candied apples. Alright, uh, orange text box? Orange text box, anybody? We're pretty much the most lovey-dovey couple. Oh, is this me and Tina? There's probably not a pair on the planet as perfect together as you and me, right? Hey, you. We're wondering if there are any Pokemon that are lovey-dovey like the two of us. If you manage to find any, bring them here. I'm sure you'll find one when LeChonk fly. That's cool that there's little, like, side quests to do afterwards. Okay, there's the other one. Sk Skitty and Waylord. Yeah, an Onyx and a Cloister? If you know what I mean. There you go. Pun, yon pun. Oh, guys, it's gonna be a ditto incident again? No, that is only in Pokemon Unbound. Yeah, write all this shit down. Oh, she's got a cute case. Huh? 
All right. Cool. Let's go. Just fucking, of course you're not. You're a part of the team. As long as Razor, I'm sure Ogre Pine will feel safe. All right. Well, we got shit to do, so I'm not going to talk to you. Yep. You going to cry? Okay. See ya. I wonder if he's still upset. All right, anyway, we got shit to do. Let's get all the masks back. You get a you get a piss your pants maybe. <laughs> I wonder what the um what the Pokemon are. Hey there. I guess I could always just look it up later. Hey Jacques, I am. Fit a research of Pokemon, Kitakami, and... That's right, sorry, I was good. Yeah, uh, didn't I... Oh, you're gonna give me a picnic? Alright, sure. Oh, hey, there's a gulpin right there. Oh, look at the tablecloth! That's so cute. Gulp of these nuts, dude? Could there be something in my basket? Uh, maybe. It's an egg! God, that egg is huge. How do 10 of them fit in a basket at once? Uh... How could it have appeared in the basket? Oh, you, you prankster. You scoundrel. You don't, you know about the Pokemon eggs you find during picnics, right? Oh, thanks for the egg, I guess. Interesting. Is this, like, the game teaching you about breeding? <laughs> In Pokemon? Good save. Let me know when you finish the... Okay. Um. I guess I'll just... Put the egg in my party and I'll hatch eventually. Yeah, dude. Uh, we'll get rid of Skeledurge for now. Spinarak. I hope it's shiny. I mean, it might be. If it's like, um... It might be like a guaranteed shiny, like the couple of instances in the, in the games where they do that. I mean, we'll see eventually. Uh, what was I gonna look at? Oh my god. Uh, Cricket Top, we know. Lorantis. No, no, we've seen all the stuff over here, okay. Alright, what's over here? Ah, for it. Okay. Um, I guess we'll just... I don't have a fast travel over there, huh? I have a fast travel over here. I might go deal with this guy. Don't know if I can catch him, but we can fight him. Where's the bird? He is the word. Oh, up in the mountains. Okay, so we have fast travel to those three. Oops. Let's set his destination. If that's a shiny shaman, I'll not do anything because I already have one. Smile. Hey, man. I don't know if I should, like, Turn off autosave. Oh my fucking lord. <laughs> Swing it again. <laughs> oh. It's so bad. 
Uh, yeah, let me take off autosave. I don't know if this is, like, where you could catch them or something, but... I also don't know if they, like, respawn if you fuck it up, but I'll just do it to be safe. Oh, I never healed or uh, Orthworm. I should probably have a bunch, right? Full restores? Yeah, sure, whatever. Alright. Hey, man. For free? Here's the buff one. Okie dokie. With all of its mean muscles. Oh, it has gotten much bigger. Oh, is this going to be one of those, uh... Whatever the fuck they're called from the main game? Where we, like, do this double battle thing? Yeah, Titan. Yeah, it absolutely is. Okay. Defense rose sharply. Hmm. Yeah, I have no idea what type you are, so I guess I'm just gonna do Iron Head and we'll see. This, that scarf's way too stylish. <laughs> Okay. Ooh, I'm dead. Oh, I lived! Okay, so it's a fighting type. We know that at the very least. Okay, thanks. Oh, he buffs us. That's cool. Hey, I'm dead this turn, so it doesn't really matter. Um, yeah, I guess I'll just guess I'll just sack here. Oh shit. Am I faster now? With the paralysis? Can I get a flinch? Any flinchers? Oh nice. Um, I don't want to do Earthquake, because I think I'll hit my teammate, right? Yeah, and I'll kill it. <laughs> I'll kill him. I'll just keep going Iron Head, I guess. Paraflinch? Paraflinch? Ah, rip. Focus Sash. Do I have another physical attack? Oh, I do have another physical attacker. I have Veluza. Veluza! Just stay in and keep fucking headbutting. Okay, so that was a dark type move, right? So I think it is at least fighting. Is it like grass fighting? Either way, I'm just uh, just gonna keep headbutting it. Oh, intimidate's nice. It's like what minus one attack and minus three defense and special defense. That's soon. I can't believe Earthworm is still here. Earthworm is supposed to die like on the second turn. Dude, fucking, I'll just keep chilling. <laughs> I'll just fucking keep chilling here. If you want to keep killing her Pokemon, I don't care. Let the worm live. Oh, hey. I get health now. I drank the matcha. Alright, I'm going to try to Earthquake here because it's going to not be very effective. Oh. So it's got to be... Is that poison? Rock? Fire? I think it's poison. I'm trying to think what else is weak to ground on top of my head. But yeah, I think it's poison. Poison fighting, maybe? Para. 
All right, well, we'll just do it again. Cool. Fuck, you should have been doing that the whole time. Oh, I guess it would have killed my teammate. Not to really make a difference, but... Maybe he's not fighting at all. Maybe that was a goof with the close combat. Anyway, we got him. There he goes! Hey, look, he dropped the mask. We're on the board, baby! Pun? <laughs> Way to go, gamers. You know, I felt this way at the Crystal Pool, too, but we make a good team, don't we? All right, two masks left. Cool. I'm guessing I can't see, like, um... What that type is, can I? Um... Oh, I just want to clear all this. Okay. Clear all this exclamation points. No, I can't see it. Okay. Sick. Um, oh, wait. The uh, the thing was right there, right? The, my, my volumes or whatever. I remembered. Yo, PP up. Let's go. Oh, bottle cap. That's kind of nice. Razor Fang. A love ball. Prism scale. Oh, that's for um, Feeboss, isn't it? Uh, go. Oh, you have to trade it as well? Okay. God, there's a lot of fucking trades in this. Uh, let's go to the bird. The bird is the word. Oh, that means we get to we get to climb this mountain again. Let's go. Party, thank you for the eleven months. Thanks Ray, for your consistent hilarity. I try my best. I'm glad you think so. Thank you for the resub. The DLC still has issues with performance. What do you mean? Look at the game right now. It looks great. Oh, what's down here? Vulpix and Geodude. Uh, nothing too crazy. Nothing we haven't seen before. Ooh, Dawnstone. Uh, nothing really over here. Oh, the Ogre Clan, huh? Hey, man. Chat, we're doing a battle. Oh. His fucking shirt. Okay, sure, man. I'm breaking the mold. Ooh, level 75. Ooh, that does so much. That's technician boosted, I think. Ooh, and he's got Thief. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. A tough battle. If only I had, like, a real <laughs> a real fucking team. Bring a ticket, done. Yeah, shot, shot to the gravel in the corner. Just bing chilling. Just enjoying the fight. Oh, my God, dude. All the coverage on this guy. This is kind of cool that they put a tough trainer over here. I probably should have done Gigaton Hammer first, actually. That was dumb. Yeah, I think I'd die here to uh, Fire Punchers or nothing I could do there. Uh, well, Fire Punch for that would be bad. Uh, we'll go Tropius. He should hopefully be able to take at least one.
Uh, we'll go Leaf Storm. I guess I could have Terrid out of my... Uh... Ooh, that crit sucked. Out of my fire weakness. Yeah, that was interesting. He had Fake Out, Fire Punch, and Thief that we saw. And that all takes advantage of... Uh... Of technician, so that is very cool. A greedent. Uh, guess I could switch out here. Switch out to Earthworm. So what is he gonna do? Body slam. Okay. Of course. Lamau. Thanks. I wonder if he's going to use, uh, what's it, Cheek Pouch? He's got Bullet Seed. That's funny. Loaded Dice Bullet Seed? Nah. No, no, uh, no Loaded Dice. Ooh, that was a nice crit. Can't believe I haven't been parried yet. There's the flinch. Ah, he does have the berry. Okay. The figgy. And he's going to get it, use it twice, yeah. Now, does he have... Uh... Oh, what the fuck is the move called where you get it back? I think there's a move like where he, where he gets it back. Oh, recycle! Yeah, I think I think it's recycle. I wonder if it's smart to shed tail here. Might not be. Into uh. I guess I could shed tail into uh. Breloom to like make this go faster because it is level 100 but I, I think it's still, I still might lose to be honest with you but um so let's go to Tropius let's try to let's try to do this without the without using Breloom oh also please remind me to put autosave back on after this all right this is four times resisted Five turns. Yep. Thank you. He probably body slams now. Um, hurricane? Nice. Alright, decent damage. That probably breaks it. Uh, Leaf Storm kill, maybe? Oh, tragic! Tragic! Oh, interesting. And a Belch. Belch is, uh, poison, I think? Poison type move? I would pay another $10 if you could skip animations in this game. If you could, it's just so much. Snorlax, huh? Well. Wait. It kind of looked like he threw out two Pokeballs. You might not be able to see it because it was behind my face cam, but. Oh, this is fucking curse lax. Oh my god. Yeah, these are like competitive builds. I wonder how many of these trainers there are. He's, he's got leftovers, right? Yeah. 
This is wild. Um, is he going to keep cursing up? He might keep cursing up. I might need to switch. This is cool. Oh, no, he's going to kill me by his here. Okay. Of course, I get rid of Skeledurge for this egg, and I could use it here. <laughs> uh, I'm going to Spore here, but I wouldn't be surprised if he has, uh, like, Sleep Talk or something, or Snore. A real Pokemon battle in a Pokemon game. Yeah, it's just like in um, BDSP where Cynthia was super tough, right? Because she had a like a, a like a proper team. Uh, Mach Punch. Uh, I'll do Seed Bomb. Let's see how much Seed Bomb does. Looks about right. Two more Seed Bombs. Or he's, oh, yep, okay. <laughs> Fucking god damn it. Oh, I hate the love system. Just hate me. Yeah, did you see the two Pokeballs again? Ooh, mouse hold. Oh, population bomb? Oh, population bomb! I'm dead here. I thought I'd be faster. Oh, wait, what? It only hit once? What? Oh, all right. Okay. That's upsetting. I know it's supposed to hit one to ten times, but it goes until it misses, right? I guess he missed immediately. All right. Rip. <laughs> that sucks. That's why you put, uh, was it, wide lens? Well, that was a cool fight. Got bailed out by the level 100, but that was cool. 7,000. Anyway, yeah, that was pretty cool. Oh! Oh, fuck, dude. Oh, damn, it's been so long. Opa Ganja style. We haven't seen that in forever. Holy shit. Thank you. That is probably our rarest alert. I will read that in one second. Let me just make sure I have everybody healed up and uh, I turn autosave back on. Dude, all the alerts are popping off today. Uh, I guess super potions are fine. Yeah, dude. Hold on. Damn, dude, throwback. Oh my god, I have to go down for every single one. All right, hey, you're going to have two less health. Hopefully, that's fun. Have these. I might as well use them. I'm not sure if I've ever actually purchased super potions, but... I just have these from picking them up. All right. Uh, auto save back on. And then we will just save normally. Sick. Uh, sick and turtle with the two hundred and ten dollar tip. Hey, Ray, keep up the good work. Been watching you since achievement hunter days, and just want to say you look spiffy. Hey, thanks, man. Thank you for the super generous. Oh my god, the thing's at three FPS. The super generous two hundred and ten dollar tip as we slowly descend into the PowerPoint presentation. I'm on my way. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. Huzzah! Hut, thank you. Turtle, thank you again. Oh, I don't like the things that are on, like, where its breasts would be. Oh, into the cave we go. Uh, oh, the whooper with those, like, spooky eyes. Um, we're back in here, huh? It's a 
this thing all the way at the bottom? Uh, hello? Oh, yeah, it is. I'm here now. Too many frames, I can almost tell what's happening. Oh, Robbie again! Two Robbies in one sh Is this legal? All the alerts going off today. I'm about to re-add the secret slime. Mr. Kuit with the $111.11 tip just says, hey, guy. Hey, man. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, they're speed rose sharply, huh? Okay. Uh, so are they, like, all poison? Is this one, like, flying poison, maybe? Let's see. I know we're enemies, but its face is so pretty. Doesn't it remind you of me a little bit? I don't... Shut up. Ooh, Toxic Chain. Oh, so that's like Poison Touch, but for Toxic, I think? Okay, so yes. It's at the very least Poison. The 69, 69 again. Dude, 98 more to get an hour of Minecraft. That's exciting. What's up, Patrick? Dude, is it because I'm wearing the brown crown shirt today? The throwback? Hey, my speed rose. So many alerts, I know. It's been so long. We'll psycho cut again, I guess. Alright, free switch. Now you T-wave, you son of a bitch. Bum, bum. Um, what can we do here? Choosing play rough? I guess we can try Earthworm. Maybe uh see if it's a fighting type here by using SmackDown. Nice. Okay, the thing is, it's on the ground, and I want to use Earthquake, but I'll explode this guy. I'm going to do it anyway, because it'll be funny. More Pico, I'm so sorry. You belong to Marnie, though. Not this bitch, not Carmine. I assume this still works like it does in, uh... Yeah, it does, okay. I wasn't sure if the, like, Smackdown effect would work on a Titan Pokemon, but it does. Alright, I'll just go for uh, Iron Heads at this point. Oh, interesting. Iron Head is super effective. I guess it. I guess it is Fairy type. So is it like? Or I guess it could be fairy, fa what, fairy, ice, rock. I think that's it. So, uh, it's probably one of those. Alright. I thought it was just a coverage move, but yeah, I guess it's a, it's probably fairy. Fairy flying or something like that. All right, let's keep fucking headbutting it.
Nice. Okay. Fenzidipity! Goodbye! Cool. Fuck, if I'd known that, I would have done Gigaton Hammer. And there it goes! Uh, Cutie Pyra, thank you for the 29 month resub. Oh, the thing's making a cute little face. Cool. All right, one more to go. Kiki should really come with us. I didn't even notice he was gone, honestly. So it's, it's fine. Okay. My Pokedex has been updated. All right, let us go heal up and then go fight the monkey. What's up, Vile? How are you, man? Vile Cinnamon Roll. That thing nuked the Kamo'o I threw out. Oh, yeah, four times a week to Fairy. <laughs> this is, like, the best part about playing uh, new Pokemon games or Pokemon DLC. Just, like, I don't know, fighting new Pokemon, trying to figure out the types and stuff. Even though it's, like, you know, it was a, it was a bird, I guess I shouldn't assume it's... A flying type because go back to grapple locked in uh gen 8 sword and shield i think it's pure fighting even though it's an octopus and i was like so sure it was a water type and it just wasn't i'm like what is happening then pure fighting it's like okay well fuck me um did i mark this oh, i did mark it no i did not mark it whoops Yeah, you just, like, never know the typing. <laughs> the face this thing is making. Alright, let's go. Oh, what's in this fire thing? I guess I can just look, right? It is... Oh. It's that one. Mien Shao. Do I have a Mien Shao? I guess I could try fighting this one. Uh oh, can I use my Skello Dirge for this? Because it's a fighting type, right? And I'm a ghost type, so. Oh, but I don't really have a way to hit it for super effect. Oh yes, I do. I have fucking Shadow Ball, right? Yeah, that might work. Um, if I have anything else, I'd probably be—I probably do have things that'll be better. Oh, you're not supposed to go there, but uh, I guess I could just use—could just use Azu again, honestly. Yeah, I'll just use Azu again. Wait the hour for this to load. Claude Sire. All right, hey, don't kill me. That'll be cringe. Yeah, dude. Oh, that doesn't do that much. Okay. Super Dan. Thank you for the 17 months. No! You son of a bitch! Ooh, he's bulking up, huh? Interesting. I mean, I'm gonna try to do the same thing. Oh, okay, well. Oh, it failed, never mind. I about to say, never mind, I'm not gonna belly drum. Hey, 
All right. Uh, I need to get a decent chunk of health back here. This might have been dumb. Ooh, poison points. Nice. We should be okay. Oh, nope. Just kidding. No. I thought that'd be enough. Hasio, kill a cliff. Thank you for the resubs. Hasio with the 100 months. Triple digits. Let's go. I guess they did bulk up, right? Um, do I need a belly drum again? Fuck it. I'm doing it. I'm throwing. I'm throwing. I'm being toxic. Aura sphere. What the fuck? Can't wait for this acrobatic secret. There we go. Sick. You're fucking dead. What do you mean? Why did I get slapped in the face before the fight was over? What the hell was that about? I got like sack tapped on the way out. Game's raids are broken even in solo. Hey, Mien Chao. Cool. Oh, that just reminded me. I never checked what those like not mint things were. I got from doing that mini game. Okay. When Mian Shao lets out a bizarre wail, you're in danger. A flurry of kicks and chops too fast to see are about to be unleashed. Okay. Pop. All right. Uh, let me see here. A mochi cake with berries needed in the dough. It increases base points for the Pokemon speed stat. Okay, so it is Eevee items. That's pretty cool. I guess, was it like, put it up by one point? It's just, it says base points. So I wonder what the value is. Oh, I picked up a mint at some point, I guess. Oh, there you go. That's how you, uh... Oh, no, that's not it. Fuck. Yeah, I forgot how to make these go down a bunch. Hmm. Anyway. Oh, there's one that'll reset Eevees completely? Oh, that's cool. I know this game also has the feathers, and the feathers do, uh... I think the feathers put it up by one, so I wonder how much the mochi does. Ginger, thank you for the 55. Welcome back, welcome back. I don't know what I hit. Oh, the egg! I forgot about the fucking egg. Okay. What did I get? Oh, they give you a starter. That's cool. I got a Chimchar. That's pretty sick. Nice. Pretty based, actually. Pretty based. Uh, no. The only performance improvement is the boxes are faster. <laughs> that I've noticed. Alright, so you guys need to... Come over here. And then Skeledurge, you'll go there. Sick. You got a Turtwig from your egg? Oh shit, is Twig here? If not, uh, I'm so sorry. If he is here, uh, you're so lucky.
Is it only Gen 4 starters? Uh, I'm going to leave with Orthworm again. Before I uh, fight the monkey. Ooh, Grassy Seed. Oh! For some reason, I thought it was Turtwig. I got excited. Never mind. Fly. I saw the little, like, things on top of its head. Dude, low tad city over here. What the fuck? I mean, I guess it makes sense. They're all lily pads, right? Rock rough over there. Yanma. All right. Let's fight monkey. What's up, Derek? Gurk. Thank you for the 33. Yep, he's got a little heart in his booty for some reason. <laughs> Special defense, huh? Okay. Um, as much as I want to use Earthquake, I'll Shed Tail out of here. Assuming I live this turn. That's going to hurt a lot. Alright, Shed Tail ain't going to work. But he's paralyzed now, so... Ripped you. You love his little flower crown? It's like a scarf or something, right? I swear this thing looks like an orange, but... Oh, thanks, my special attack. Wonderful. It looks like an orange with a blanket. Alright, we'll just, like, try to will it down. Yep, we know it's weak to dark. Dumbass ogre. Yo, get him. Is that toward me? That's going to kill me, right? Okay. No. Dumb, dumb. Let's just use Tinkaton. We haven't used Tinkaton in a while. Oh shit, this hits my teammate as well. Oh fuck, my bad. <laughs> just smack this mouse in the face of my hammer. <laughs> oh shit, my bad, dude. I didn't realize I hit multiple targets. Pop. I'm going to hit him again, so just ignore me. Or maybe this will kill. Okay, well, I'm going to hit the mouse again. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Wham! We're good. Watch out if you raid with me. Dude, don't raid with Spencer. He always threatens spamming Earthquake to take out his own team. Alright, we got all the masks. Nice. Way to go, gang. Oh, this shitter. Where'd you find the egg? Uh, I talked to Jacques, and he just gave me the egg. 
Come to the village and bring the ogre with you. But the villagers. You gotta trust me. Oh, shit. All right. All right, man, if you say so. Bun? If things go south, I'll use my natural charm. Oh, great. We're fucked. All right, back to Missouri we go. Anything crazy over here? Like a shiny Lotad or something? A blue Yanma, maybe? Like double-digit frames? Oh, hey, a Munchlax. Oh, a Lycanroc. Anything else over here? Anything, anything crazy? Uh, I don't think so. Oh, I haven't got a Hoot Hoot yet. There's Hoot Hoots over here? Oh, like maybe in the trees because they're birds? Does that make sense? Oh, a Wercorio. Oh, I've unlocked a new area for the Ogre Ousting game. Oh shit, it's a gang of birds. I'm gonna get jumped. Bunch of grubbins. Cutie fly. Ah, oh, Pikachu! I can't believe they put Pikachu. Such an such a unpopular Pokemon. I'm glad it, they're finally showing it some love. Anything else over here? Mm, nope. Mankey doing his thing. Curlia. Alright. It's, it's about time, yeah. Finally getting the love it deserves. It's afraid! You really don't want to be here, do you? Don't worry, it'll be fine. He promises. I know you must be scared, Ogre Palm, but I did my best. So just trust me and come with me, okay? What do you mean, did your best? What'd you even do? Time to scare everybody. Cutscene. Hey guys, look, we found an ogre. That's the ogre. Ogre pond. It's actually real. Don't worry, buddy. So this is the ogre of Oni Mountain. This is the true face of Ogre Pond whom we've so sorely wronged. For far too long, we've told tales casting you as the villain here in Kitakami. We all owe you a great apology. What's going on? Why the sudden about face? Oh, Kiki's been telling everybody. Oh, okay. Sick. We're so sorry, dear ogre. Can't wait for the first mod of this game to have this Pokemon just straight up be Shrek. From now on, you can come to the village whenever you want. Don't need to hide your face when you do. The three masks we kept at Kitakami Hall rightfully belonged to you all along. If you manage to get them back from those three villains, please feel welcome to keep them. We got the mask back. We managed to clear Ogre Pond's name. That's what we call a happy ending. One last thing to do, let's escort Ogre Pond back to its home. Yeah!
All right. So, uh, we just gonna fast travel back, or? It's time to fucking climb that mountain again. Let's go back to the crystal pool. The Rayway. I didn't mark it. Whoops. Um, here we go. Ooh, Chuckles. Thank you for the, uh, two years. Up and over. <laughs> Oh, well, that one actually wasn't too bad. All right. Chad, it's just so convenient. There's like a just a big opening right here. Oh, shit. Oh, no, we're here. We're here. Okay. I thought I jumped too far. Here's your literal hole in the wall. Well, here we are. It's a bit lonely out here, but I guess this place must mean a lot to Ogre Pond. Bye-bye. Poe? Oh. Hey, you know what? I think Ogre Pond might want to go with you, Ray. Oh, sick. Yeah, not you, idiot. They like me more. Are you going to want to battle again? Because you want the ogre? It... Here we go. Kiki, it doesn't like you. Yeah, all right. Fuck, whatever. You want to battle anyway. All right. Yeah, sure. Let me know once you're ready. What if I just take the Pokemon and leave? I'm, I'm never ready. I never want to battle you. Yeah, I got my scuff team. What is that? What if I just lead with Skeledurge and just wipe him? You know what? I'm going to do that. Not lead with him, but... See if I could shed tail into it. If not, then I'll just throw it out and just wipe. Or just kill him. I guess it depends on what he sends out. I've had enough of this kid. Can't wait for him to beat me now. Oh, is your hair in the way? Was that when you were trying to clear the hair in front of your face? Who would have thought? Real Mythics, thank you for the 73. It does look like his bangs are doing the degeneration X suck it, but instead of on its crotch, it's on like his mouth. Oh, shift tree. Dude, I'm glad you think I'm a better trainer, but I'm really just using this team I threw together. Completely unnecessary. I wonder if he's going to use a dark move because then I'll break the uh, I'll break the substitute. Yeah, he's using dark pulse. Okay. Well, there goes that. I guess that was a nothing burger of a couple of turns. Ooh. Do I get the boost from Throat Spray as well? Does he have a Focus Sash? 
lot of a lot of focus sashes being used in this DLC for some reason. And then the throat spray. Okay, so I'm plus two now. Does he like counter now? Oh, he just dark pulses. Okay. Yeah, hey, I'm here to still send a message, so fuck you. I'm over it. So far, the, the toughest uh, fight, without a doubt, has been that one uh, that one trainer in the mountains we fought. That was a cool fight. Polyrath. Okay. I'm like plus four right now, so I think Torch Song still would have killed, but I've had enough with this kid. Chad, he's here. The Schnoz! Oh, he's got sturdy. Bump, 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 bump. What kind of berry? Speed berry? Uh, special attack. Too bad I'm, uh, uh, <laughs> what is it? Oh, God. What's the thing where I ignore stats? Oh, I'm unaware. So that doesn't even matter that he got that. I ignore my, what is it, my opponent's stat buffs. Yon Mega. He got the Omni Boost. Damn. Skeledurge is a walking tank. Yeah, it doesn't help that I'm level 100 and I actually like properly Eevee train this and everything because I was using it for raids for a while. Sorry, kid. Welcome to the real world, jackass. Actually, is this Skeledurge the, my original Skeledurge? I don't remember. Doesn't matter. How much is this DLC? I don't remember because I pre-ordered it the day you could, and I forgot the price. It's $30 for both parts. Okay, yeah. I think it's the same as... Um, the same as it was for Sword and Shield, right? Three comet shards. Okay, so let's see. I forgot to do this last time. Poison fighting, so Toxicroak. Psychic poison and fairy poison. Yeah, so see, this wasn't a bird at all. Psychic poison. Is it was is poison psychic unique? I'm trying to think of all fucking 
1,000 Pokemon. I'm, I don't think it is. But it might be. Also, is Fairy? No, Fairy Poison. That's um, Galarian Weezing, right? Oh, this is Galarian uh, Slowking. Yeah. No, Inke and Malamar are Poison or Psychic Dark. Yeah, the, the Galarian Slowpoke line. Yeah. I think Fairy Poison. Is this not Galarian Weezing? Right? Is that Poison Fairy? Am I making that up? It is, yeah. Okay, so none of these unique typing. Oh, it's Spinarak. Is that new? Cool. Oh, we're getting raided by fucking Chibi Doki. All right, everyone. Thanks for coming. Stream's over. Uh, see you later. Chibi, thank you for the raid. Hope you're doing well. Welcome on in. Oh, they want to... Oh, I have to prove that I can catch this. Okay, let me actually save here. Um, YouTube, I'll be right back. Let me go talk to the raiders. All right, YouTube, we're back. I'll turn off uh, autosave here, just in case I botch this. But uh, we're gamers, so maybe we won't. I'm also just going to throw a quick ball and see if that works. Oh, unless I have to, like, beat this up first, which might happen. Uh, we'll Tropius. All right. Oh, but I'm going to assume all these, like, legendaries or whatever they are are shiny locked. They are? Yeah, of course. <laughs> Why wouldn't they be? Oh, shit. Oh, is he going to transform with the mask? Oh, this thing is just fucking cast form. Oh, all right. Cool. They made cast form a legendary. Oh, this is like a Titan battle. Okay. Oh, this is kind of cool, actually. It terrestrialized its mask. Oh, damn. Well, I'm a grass type, so this is bad. Embody aspect. And it's attack rose, huh? Chuckles, I'm in danger. I guess I can get rid of my, uh... My, uh... Grass typing. Thank you, Silver Fox, for the 80. Jewish hobo. Wind Squid, Star, Leah. Thank you, gamers. Okay. Ivy, you're, those are just war. What, what the fuck does that even mean? Oh, I'm fine. I eat those. That actually did way more than I thought. Fuck yeah. All right, well, I'm dead here, so F. I don't know. Oh, did I live because of love? You fucking... I hate this mechanic. Okay. Anyway. I should have exploded, but I lived. Love wins. Oh, and now it kicks me. Are you for real? Love wins again. Okay, I missed. Good. Balanced. Can, can you just kill me so I can switch Pokemon? Oh. Okay, well, now you're going to... What do... All right. All right, well, I can't believe I lived. That's just the power of Dole, baby. Dole!
Memories of adventuring with you grant Ogre Pond strength. Are you going to put on all of the other masks? Okay, yeah, that makes sense. I can't believe that this Pokemon is just cast form. So what went up now? Uh, special defense. Oh, that's unfortunate. Uh, I guess I'll just Leaf Storm here, because I'm probably going to get blown back. Am I going to live on bullshit? No, okay. I'm finally dead. Justice. No! Um, all right. Well, I don't want to go Breloom yet. Hmm. I guess I go Veluza. Why not? I guess if I fail this, I could just uh, start the fight back up with uh, Skeledurge and just run through it. Yeah, that did a decent chunk. Dude, I'm breaking the mold. Can I get a spicy crit? Any crits in the chat? Do I even live this, actually? I do. Ooh. I'm going to Aqua Jet here. It's not going to kill, but I'll just do, like, residual, like, a little bit more damage. Unless I crit! Oh, feels bad. The grassy terrain kept it alive. I guess, to be fair, it kept me alive, so... Sorry, Veluza, I tried, but at the end of the day, you are still a Veluza, so. I did what I could with what I had. <laughs> uh, we'll take a ton here. Uh, we'll gigaton. How much is this gonna do? Whammy. Oh, Tinkaton's got a great design. I love the design of Tinkaton. Um, it's just, you know, not great. I do wish the shiny was better, too. I agree. All right, so that was fire, or it was water. First it was fire, then it was water, then... Oh, this thing has, like, the Giratina things behind it. What the fuck is this? Oh, well, whatever it is, it's weak to, uh... Steel. Protect here. Yeah, <laughs> it's water again. Whatever it is, it might fucking kill me. Hammer! Oh, shit. Uh, it's got like kind of like a brown essence around it, so maybe it's like rock. Uh, I'm dead here regardless, so I'll just brutal swing. Pop. It's the worm! Oh, it's weak to ground and iron. Yeah, it's got to be a rock type. Going to headbutt it. Pop. Oh, 
All right, so this is the last mass grip. Fire, water, rock, and I guess this is grass. It's speed, Rose. Um... Fucking Earthworm's face. Just like slight concern. Yeah. Oh, actually, I might have been able to shed tail there. Wow, that. Oh, that was a crit. I was about to say, that did, that did so much damage. Yeah, Earthworm has the W emote. Ranger W. Can't catch it yet? Yeah, I know. Alright, so I assume he goes for low kick again, which is a free switch into Skeledurge, we can just wrap this up. Hello! Got him. Is Ogre Pond a legendary? Yeah, I assume this and the other three guys count as legendaries. There we go. Yeah, we're still playing this tomorrow. I want to finish, like, the main story today. I don't know how close I am to that. And then tomorrow we'll do, uh... Side quest and finish the Pokedex. Is this a guaranteed catch, by the way? I assume it is, because it's like a raid battle. Um, What ball should I put it in? Could do Beast Ball, but... Dusk Ball. It's Nest Ball. I'm looking at like the green Pokeballs I have. The Friend Ball? Oh, he's kind of a friend. I might do friend ball. Yeah, we'll do friend ball. It breaks out. Nice. Let's go. Pure grass. Oh, just like Calyrex. This Pokemon's type changes based on which mask it's wearing. It confounds its enemies with nimble movements and kicks. I wonder if it has any competitive relevancy. Why was the text laggy? <laughs> Why? Why was the text laggy? It's a text box. Uh, Ogre Pond entrusts you with the Cornerstone Mask, Wellspring Mask, and Her Hearth Flame Mask. Okay. 4K, 4K font. Well done, Ray. That's pretty impressive. Congratulations. Thanks, man. Yeah. <laughs> Sag. Uh, why can't I be like you, Ray? Uh, it's the 51 difference, Kieran. You know, not everyone can achieve that. And arguably, 50 people are better than me. Oh, he's going to go fucking cry. You're going to cry? You're going to piss your pants? I hate it when he gets like that. Kids, right? Let's head home. Okay. Go smack some sense into him. <laughs> the next day? Hi, Clefable. Hey, Ray, good morning. I got a message from Carmine. She says she's waiting for you at Loyalty Plaza and that you should hurry up and meet her there. Okay. Say, why do you two always use me as your messenger boy, huh? Because you're, you don't even have a name. 
That's how we keep you, like, relevant in this DLC. Oh, shit! This thing has Defiant. Interesting. Kind of want to look at this thing. So... This user strikes with an ivy wrapped cudgel. The moves type changes depending on the mask. Oh. It has a heightened chance of landing a crit. And it's 100 power, 100 accuracy. This thing had slam? Why? What other moves can it learn? Oh, horn, horn leech? Superpower? Spiky shield? Power whip? Okay. Growth? Leech seed? Okay. Mine does attack up, defense down. Okay. That's pretty cool. Sick. That Pokemon can only be female, you said? Oh, dude, this game is turbo woke. After I'm done with Bud Light, dude. Game Freak, I'm protesting you, all right? There's all those Vulpix up there. Um, let's save. I will also put on auto save again. Uh, auto save on. There is. Oh, I guess you could skip cutscenes. That's right. I totally forgot about that. Wait, was that always there? Actually, skip cutscenes. Whoops, wrong button. I guess I haven't done another playthrough of this game, so... Obviously, I just let the cutscenes play on my first playthrough. It was, but it's very selective about what it thinks a cutscene is. Yeah, I was gonna say, because you can just skip cutscene and then skip the first five hours of the game and just actually start. Which would be nice. Oops. There you are, you took your time. You really battled great yesterday, right? Thanks, man. I guess the Master Chief of Squad has completed its mission. Yeah, dude. Though Kiki, he shut himself in his room ever since he got home yesterday. That's worrying. Ooh, Prophet and Jason. Thank you for the resubs, guys. Yeah, dude. You don't need to feel guilty or anything, Ray. Oh, I don't. I don't give a shit about Kiki. It all started because I said we should keep the whole Ogre Pond thing a secret. Yeah, that's your problem. It's not mine at all. He doesn't take to losing well. That's Well, he loses a lot, so he should probably get better. How's Ogre Pond doing? Oh, it's just going to live in my box or Pokemon home for the rest of its life. It's enslaved, so it's doing great. No. Absolutely not. Fuck you. Do we have to battle? We sure do. Do I need to have it in my party, I guess? Or can I just, like, not use it? All right. I guess we have to. Okay, I do need to have it in my party. Okay. I guess I'll just leave it as is, huh? We'll get rid of, uh... We'll get rid of Breloom for this. Oh, yeah, let me quickly look at the masks I have as well. That's a good point. Are they, were they just in my, like, items, or...? Why do I have 19 ability capsules? Oh! Wait, I remember! Okay, it all makes sense. It just... I just had a Jimmy Neutron brain blast chat. There was a fucking duplication glitch you could do early on with like your starter with Coridon. So what you did is you duped, I think the ability patch because you could sell it for a bunch of money. That's what I, that's why I have 999 Pokeballs. I just completely forgot about that until right now. 
I don't think I duped the candy. I think the candy is just for me, like, doing raids. But the reason I have so much money is because, yeah, I did that. I totally forgot about that. Um... Okay, yeah, so you make it a water type. I see, I see, okay. It was water type. Where's the other one? Um... Oh, there's the muscle mochi. This is fire, of course. Grassy seed, sure. And, yeah, rock type. Um... You know what? Let's make this thing rock type. Why not? Assuming I can, like... Oh, wow. I actually probably should heal it. It's at one health. <laughs> I don't know if it's going to see any play, but... There you go, man. Good thing I saw that. If I threw it out and had one health, it'd be like, uh, big gulps, huh? Cool. Is that how that works? Oh, hey. Oh, the cloak changes! Oh, that's cute. That's a nice little feature. Why did it stand there? Oh, because this game's a meme. Zero competitive viability because it has to hold the mask. That sucks. Well, I mean... Is it worth using without a mask? Maybe? Being forced to hold a mask does kind of kill it. Uh, and you can't change its terror typing. Okay, so uh, never mind. Yeah, it has no fucking shot. It is literally cast form. It's like we've gave cast form better stats, but it's still ass, so don't use it. But it, yeah, it is cute. There's that. Cast form also does look like a Pokemon that has a nutsack on it, so it's got that going for it. Tropius, you suck! I wonder if it's going to fall to, like, PU or something. That might be a little harsh. I guess we'll see. Uh, tomorrow's stream will be completing the decks and any side missions and stuff to do. I'll need help from, uh... Oh, get f oh he killed himself in-game. Idiot. I'll need help from chat for some trades and stuff. Ooh, Ninetales. Nine Tails. Uh, dude, we'll Terra again. We'll get rid of our fucking fire weakness. You also need the trades? Okay. Sounds good. For people who... Oh my god, did I just get punched in the nuts? Sure did. I just got trolled. I just got lay epic troll, dude. Dragon Pulse. Uh, for people who have played this DLC, am I near the um, near the end of the story? That does no damage. Uh, oh wait, I'm fucking. I have a rock type. I think right. It turns into a rock type. This is the very end. Okay, I was about to say this feels like the end. I'm breaking the mold. Fucking eat my ass. Okay, let's see if I understand how this works correctly. So... Oh, it's grass rock now. Oh, and then you, you, you tear it into that. I see. Okay. All right, let's see how this works. Can't wait for this thing to fucking <laughs> one-shot me. How much does this do? Oh, we're fine. We eat that. No burn? No burn? And the miss! Eat my ass! Hit it with the fucking kebab! Nice. Huge.
Yeah, it looks like your typing and your Terra is mass dependent, so yeah. It's a cool idea for a Pokemon, but yeah, viability competitively is like... There's no... There's nothing there for it. Oh, well, this is awkward. Um... Oh, wait, no, you're a bug type. Never mind. Hit him with the kebab! Nice. The ability is also dependent on the mask, is it? Do I not have Defiant right now? Uh, oh no, I have Sturdy. Oh shit, I didn't even notice that. Um, oh fuck. Well, I'm just gonna keep hitting it with my stick. Sash? Yeah, the, the idea of this Pokemon is really, really cool. But yeah, the fact that you have to hold a, uh, you have to hold the mask does kind of kill it. Um, low kick. Pop. Water gets water absorb, and fire gets mold breaker. Oh. That's pretty cool. Alright, um... Oh, yeah. I have fucking nothing here. All right, Tropius. Big T coming in to get the final kill. The final kill of the story. All right, what are you doing here? Oh, that's the move that burns. That's right. That's the that's the move that... What was it? It's like Mega Drain and, or Giga Drain, but it also burns. Is the burn guaranteed? It's using Hex! Where's Spencer? Hell yeah. It just has a chance to burn? Okay. I wasn't sure if it was guaranteed. Nice. I lost, but I'm also not surprised. You and Ogre Pond really do get along, don't you? It's almost making me jealous. Pon Pon. I actually, uh, sheesh, this is awkward to tell you, but I, oh, rotototo. This is Briar. It seems all student pairs have completed their oriented in the morning. Caretaker wanted to have some, oh yeah, sure. Right, I forgot. This is like a school trip, the reason we're here. Yeah, 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 we're besties now, whatever. Carmine, let's go. Let's wrap up this story. She was about, yeah, she was about to confess her love to us. We got blue balled. Feels bad. Your boy caught COVID again. I'm sorry, man. Yeah, I somehow dodged it from this trip to LA and New York. I don't think we have a battle coming up, but just to be safe. <laughs> Okay. All right, stop crouching. Uh, if I roll credits, we're going to have to worry about Ed Sharon again. I don't think there's going to be credits to the DLC, but I hope not. If I hear any music, I'll just kick my streaming computer just so it breaks. All right, Caretaker, send us out, man.
We found them all. A gift! Oh my god. The mochi set. Okay. Interesting. However... Oh no, they need to go to Blueberry Academy? Drats. I thought this Briar chick was going to be like a villain or some shit. Maybe the next DLC. My brother's not feeling well, so it's just me here to speak. Let's hear it. This village is where I was born. You didn't want any outsiders coming here at all. Yep, I can tell. <laughs> Yikes. Our home was being turned into a tourist trap for a bunch of ignorant strangers. Oh my god. Feels like the Game Freak employees are lashing out. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad you had fun. Yeah, I had fun. Especially with you. Oh, thank you. I'm glad you came to visit. Yeah, dude. Hey, if you're in the next DLC, can you, like, cut your bangs or, like, get a different haircut? It's, like, triggering me because my bangs are fucking annoying and I don't know what to do about it. All right, Carmine, see you later. This is not goodbye, okay? We'll definitely see each other again. Fucking trips. Bye! Thank you, caretaker. I don't know what you did, but... Thank you! And then we never saw Carmine or Kiki again. I need to become... I need to become a lot stronger. All right, weirdo. Yes, yeah, this is Joker moment. Is he going to write damage on his forehead or whatever? This is his Nishki moment? Oh, shit. Alright, bro. Well, I'll fucking... I have level 100 Pokemon, so you're, you're donezo. To be continued. Oh, fuck. Damn, dude. Spooky. Who made my face cam border? It is a graphic designer who works for us. Her name is Meg. She works for FrameRateMerch.com and Mega64. She uh, she made the border, and then Tina and I added the sub count and the uh, like the clickable links down here. Damn, dude. All right, so that's dramatic. I guess they show up again in DLC too. All right, well, I'm going to stand and save right next to the biggest mommy of this DLC. Looks like she's wearing Crocs as well. My kind of woman. All right, gamers. Finished the story today. That was pretty fun. Obviously, the game runs like total dog shit, but it was a fun uh, five, and a half, five and a half hours. Like I said, we'll be back tomorrow. We have the Nintendo Direct. We have the Sony State of Play, and then we'll also try and finish up the, um, the Pokedex and any side bonus content uh, in this tomorrow. So, hope you guys enjoyed part one, or I guess this is technically... This is part one of this, but part seven of my Scarlet playthrough, I think. I could be wrong. But YouTube, hope you enjoyed. I'll see you tomorrow. I love you.